you uh you hit the um you hit the books and write down your catchphrases or how do you come up with these bad boys they just come up to you naturally Honestly, I feel like the catchphrases were coming, bro, when I was taking hella blinkers and my brain just had a hella metal in it. <laughs> and so it was just like glitch, it was like glitching and producing the craziest. Let me open up this bad boy and let's get a start. Oh, we're smoking right. that? Ooh. Oh, you're horny as fuck over there. Let's go. That's a sexual start. That's horny as fuck. No, I don't even know what that is. Oh, no, you never shot. Actually, you've Ooh. never smoked one of those? I've never heard of it before. Oh, let's go. Oh, let's go. Oh, this might be they're the best fire, hash oil in the game, period. No way. They're in the, no, in the awesome. discussion. They're up These are really, really, really fire. Jake rolls. Yeah, Jake yeah, we got Jake as well. Fire as well. Jake as well. Some biscotti and limon. Yo, Eric, you want? You have a torch lighter? I will take a torch lighter, please. Oh, Simi, of course, please. of course. Simi, getting it started down? off nah. on a banger, man. We had to get it started on a little That's smoking lit. something, man. Best We're believe on it, motherfucker. Best believe yeah. it, baby. You heard, you heard it was here, man. That's like a little sound bit. Episode 79 of Pine Park After Dark. I'm your host, Eric Khan. We got the usual people, Tim Goblin over there. The and a very suspects. special, very overdue guest right beside me, man. Motherfucking Fulcrum, Damien Love. Thank you for having me, Thank you for coming, man. Thanks for coming, it really does mean a lot. Fulcrum, come in. Yo. Yo, gang, you feel me? Best go. believe it. Best, yeah. believe, it. Best yeah. believe it, man. Yeah. No, thank you guys for Holy having shit. me, bro. I've been wanting to do this shit for like probably like a year now or so. Yeah, Almost saying. a year. Hundred percent. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. We've been talking about doing this for a while. We've wanted to have you on for a while. It's a pleasure to have you here. I think Hell it's going to yeah. be a banger of an episode for sure. Hell yeah, it's bro! It's trippy sitting one. next to Goblin and Eric at the same time, bro. Because you know I mean? I've been fucking with the content for years. Since I was like a teenager, for sure, for sure. Thank Damn, you, bro. Man. I really yeah. fuck with what you're doing too. You're, Thank you're you, bro. Putting out some dope content. You know, you're you're really shaking uh, up the game. You're shaking you're up shaking the game. Up yeah, the you're game. changing the game, honestly. Hell yeah, you know? bro. You're killing it. You so, did something. Bro. In fact, Props you did you. something last night that no one's ever done before, huh? Wiz mm. Khalifa's first ever live stream. Mm. He said that. Like, yeah, never yeah, done that a live stream trippy, before. Bro. Never you done. Shout out to Wiz Khalifa. Shout out to everyone who was involved with that stream. It was insane. Astro Club. Yep. Shout out to Astro Club for letting us do that stream. Yeah, bro, that was mind blowing, bro. It felt Man. like a dream. Yeah, yeah it super feel like dope. real life. As soon as he walked in, we were like, "Whoa!" Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Imagine it was some impersonator. I was like, "What if we got, <laughs> what if we got Pizza Brian to come in with like dreads?" That's risky. <laughs> <laughs> the impersonator game's heavy right now. That's what people are doing. Yeah, like the Aiden Ross, Kim Jong Un shit. <laughs> you seen oh, that? I, I yeah, forgot yeah, about yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Dude. that was, that funny. was, that was so fun. good. That was really pumped <laughs> up too. People were people were thinking it was gonna happen. Bruh, I thought it was gonna happen. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I kind of did too. In like a slight way, I was like, wait. You guys actually thought he was gonna talk to Kim Jong Un? I did for a second, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Because I let, I honestly, I was like, there's I no way. Like, and then I let people convince me, no, he for real will, bro. He for real will, bro. <laughs> there's no way Aiden Ross has that pull, though, right? Like, he can't tap in with Kim Jong-un. Like, the only Americans that Kim Jong-un fucks with are dudes that play basketball. And the only evidence of that is Dennis Rodman. He's fucking tight with that dude, right? Yeah, he's they are them, friends. Like, he's he's, he's, yeah, tight, with, he's yeah. tight with LeBron. So maybe he could pull a Oh, is he? There. What if yeah, what if yeah, King Jong Un is, like watches Pine Park every oh week? Oh my god. god. We, we would like you as a guest for episode what? whatever. You just let us would know. The feds are kicking nah, the door. I don't give a fuck. That's cancelable. We're pulling him up. That, we're definitely doing that. You're gonna have to go to him. We'll go. Yeah. Oh. Well, let's we'll go. Pull up to the studio. Oh, we'll see. meet him on the house. <laughs> you don't think he can park me there. He's probably meet him on the border. South Korea, Korea, and then the demilitarized zone. Oh yeah, that little trailer that they always meet in. Yeah. Whoa, that'd be sick. That's they what like we'll do the, the podcast. Yeah, that's what we'll do the podcast. Or he'll sit on that side. What if he gives us exclusive access <clears throat> to like the capital? He's like, come to my palace. Yeah, that's what he would do. Chill, you know? He would want like, it to look fucking. He'd want amazing, it to look right? good, you know. He so would we, want we, it to be in a controlled environment too, that like he'd have a hundred percent control over. Yes, yes. He would want Eric, you guys get to go killed, to bro. him. Don't Dude. get us killed saying some fucking such shit to, to Kim Jong Il, bro. It. <laughs> no, it's he it it might it take us it. out, bro. Hey, no, we're good. I'm not sure if I'm down to go. <laughs> I don't know if I want to go. Cheers, my friends. Dabbington City. Fuck yeah. <laughs> what you got in that little puff? So fucking funny. I'm smoking this one. I just loaded up all the rock, rock and peaches. peaches. Rock and peaches. Man. Also Great got pick. the archive from Aster. Yep. We got the gat, the hash house too. <laughs> hash Wonderful. house, John, man. Hell yeah. yeah. 
good flavors on the table, bro. All about, about the flavor. You told me yeah, something you. the other week that blew my mind. You said you got a gift from a great company, half ounce of rosin. You smoked it in a week. Yeah. You, wow. You, <laughs> you, you rolled it up too, man. You rolled yeah. it up a little bit. Yeah, it's two grand yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Rolling it up, bro. I probably smoked a zipper rosin in two weeks though. Let's go. Wow. Because I bought 14 grams like the week before that. I smoked <laughs> through that one. Are you, are you normally just rolling up like hash holes? Is that how you're smoking it? most of the time are you using the puff See, if i have a large amount of like hash then i'm rolling it up okay yeah just makes the most sense right that yeah does, because it's I like feel. how am i gonna smoke all this shit yeah you're not, it's impossible <laughs> yeah <laughs> do you ever dab like traditionally out of a rig with like a you know torsion banger with my friends but honestly i don't have crazy glass at home i have like china glass you know yeah most honestly, of the time i'm using an e-rig or some shit Okay. China glass is cool, bro. It does like glass is glass at the end of the day, as long as the functions good. It works, yeah. You know, yeah. It works. It gets you. It gets you high. And you know, there's a lot of uh, a lot of artists in like China that you can find on Instagram that actually do decent shit. Like they they do really good function work. You know, it's not the same maybe art as uh, some of the heady like really? American glass, yeah. but you can get Start a lot of good it. function oh, really really affordably out of Chinese glass. You know, so Ooh, that pretty joint. pretty valid. And if they break, it's like, fuck it. You know? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, like, I, you know? <laughs> Not super stressed on it. Yeah. 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 It's better than breaking like a 20,000 piece of little glass. Oh, you feel me? fuck. Oh, God. That would be rough. Yeah, I've broken some, that would some be ones that rough. broke my heart. You know, it's not rough. <laughs> the what's, the most, what's the most expensive glass you guys broke? Damn. Oh. I think I learned my lesson with China glass, actually. I haven't really broken any expensive things. Oh my gosh. Knock, as as knock, it, can, knock yeah. everywhere. Knock right? everything for <laughs> sure. But no, I, thankfully I haven't broken. I mean, I've broken a banger, actually. Actually, I had like a big stand of all my bangers and I put Oh, them I remember when this. And no. it fucking fell. It was the day before 710. No. It was the day before 710. And uh, I dropped like four or five like expensive ass bangers. Nah. It was fucked up. It was and bangers can get it? expensive too, though. Like, yeah, like expensive. I probably lost like two, three dollars. grand worth of yeah, bangers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, it was fucked up. Two, it was all grand. at once, all at once, too. It was fucking <sighs> insane. I didn't even know what to think. I was like, well. Did you shed a tear? A slight tear, yeah. It was like going down slowly in my face. <laughs> like the commercials. Were you emo the other day? <laughs> Put my hair down, straight and shit. <laughs> it's a Spider Man 3 emo shit, man. Hell shit. yeah. Oh Quick shout out to the boys it. over at Imperial Extraction, by the way, for sponsoring this episode, man. Good people over there. You can get yourself a free pre roll of any of their three exotic flavors, man. That's gram and a half of top shelf flower, 0.5 of THCA diamonds, man. Go to imperialextraction.com slash pine park and use code pine park, P I N E P A R K, to get your free. Two grand pre roll. You heard it free, man. You get what a, free, a deal. Free shipping. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, man. Cover oh, that bro. shipping, man. Oh, Cover yeah, that dude. motherfucking shipping, bro. Yeah. You roll up right duty. now, my friend. Maybe we should roll up a little bit. We got the points. We got the. Mm. What do you think of the stir? Yo, that shit is blowing perfectly. It's proper bro, for sure. It is kind of proper. Fire. Bro, that's what I'm saying. I, I don't like think I've ever smoked that before. Hell yeah. I'm I've put you on. Maybe I've seen it once on Instagram <clears throat> from you or someone. Right, 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 right. I don't know where I've seen it. But. You remember the first time you blew down some pack? The very first time, full from smoke gas? Like, smoked weed? Mm hmm. Yeah, I do remember the first time I smoked weed, bro. Basically, I mean, the first time I got high was an edible. Oh, yeah. That's a crazy way to get high for the first time. Yeah, I was 15, but the first time I smoked like Bud was when I was 16. My friend got like these shitty ass rinky dink. He bought two joints from this hippie kid. Okay. <laughs> he this, bought a pre rolled already. Yeah, they met, at the, they met at the Jack in the Box, and the hippie kid pulled up on a longboard and served him some <laughs> rinky dink ass <laughs> fucking pre rolls, bro. <laughs> I love that. Bro, hippie rinky kid rinky had dink. some booze. I love that. But we smoked them like we went into some field at nighttime where no one like could see us. Yep. Smoked them as fast as we could. We probably smoked both of them in five minutes, like hella fast. Damn. Like, paranoid <laughs> Just and scared. the fuck out of them. We were scared we were going to get like caught, you know? Yeah. Like, yeah, we're chiefing them. <laughs> Both of them back to back. I remember there was no filter on that shit. Uh -huh. And my friend, like, he, in he inhaled like a fire ember into his lung, bro. <laughs> oh, no. Dude, and where it was this at? You grew up in Antioch? Uh, this was in fucking Brentwood. This was mm -hmm. in Brentwood, you feel me? Brentwood. So you grew up in Cali, though? Yeah, Cali, the East Bay area. East Bay, okay. Yeah, this is where we went to high school. I, I went so. to high school in freaking Brentwood. Yeah. But yeah, bro, god damn it, bro. Like, I was weak and I had. So much like, I had like a panic attack, bro. I got too high because I smoked too much at once, bro. For the first time, hell nah, bro. 
Yeah, it's kind of like the first time it can be super overwhelming. You don't even know what to expect. Yeah, you know, like you've never been <laughs> fucked did, up before. Did you stop time. fucking with it after that, or did you keep smoking? You're like, I'll try it again. No, nah, like. like Probably like shortly after that, I was hitting my friends like wax pens and I was enjoying that because I was like, yo, if I don't like overdo it, then it's enjoyable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you can control yeah. it more than like a joint. You don't yeah. got to smoke the whole joint or anything crazy. Just like a, yeah. like a rip or two. Word. Do you Where's remember you? what carts you were smoking <laughs> the first rips? First carts? Bro, come on, they're like $15 <laughs> bullshit, bro. Like, the friends buy, as fuck. That's the what friends it was for buy, everybody. Yeah, my friends buying $15 bullshit from Little Hell Mickey. Yeah. Little Hell Mickey down yeah. the street. <laughs> uh, little Mickey? Yeah, little Mickey sells a bullshit down the street at the gas station, bro. Damn. Shout out little Mickey. And Sounds young Jamario, cool. too. They be trapping the bullshit. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I mean, how, like, how trash were they? Like, were you coughing a lung up after every rip? No, they weren't like, that bad, bro. Honestly, okay. I was smoking my friends. Just they Disty? Was, yeah, like, Disty, my friends would get them from the freaking medical dispensaries. But remember back oh, okay. in the day, like... Anyone can like open up shop and see. You yeah, feel yeah. Me? Just throw the little like green medical plus sign yeah. up outside the door and sell weed. Anyone could set up shop on Weed Maps or freaking um. Word. Set up a store, rinky ding hole in the wall store, bro. That shit was crazy. <laughs> back in like 2017. Yeah, before, yeah back before, in the day. Yeah. Did you have a med card? Yeah, when I turned 18, I bought a med card. As soon as you turn 18, yeah, yeah. buying the legal pack. The move. Shiny by the legal pack. I spent 100, like, 40 bucks on that hoe. Damn, like a little phone call? Which one was that? Would you go to the doctor? I went to a doctor, and they set me up with the doctor on an iPad. <laughs> and on FaceTime? Yeah, and I had all, this whole script in my head how I was going to score the thing, and it was like a two-minute phone call. He was yeah, like, yeah, he was like, all right, you can get it. Yep. I'll see you next year. <laughs> See, that's what he said. I'll see you next year. He said, thanks, <laughs> thanks for the bread. That's how it is. Yeah, like, thanks for the hundred bucks. That's exactly what the guy said in his bread. He's like, thanks for the money. That's how it is bitch. with all of yeah, them. Yeah, for real. Like, yoink. Yo, that shit's a scam. For sure. Dude, it's a fucking scam. 100%. I had my medical scam. card in Illinois, and it was the same thing. The guy called me on the phone. I had this whole thing thought out in my head. He was like, um, what, what's your issue? I was like, I can't sleep well. I have insomnia. I sleep like a baby, bro. Uh, mm. I was like, I can't sleep well. He's like, okay. You have trouble sleeping? I was like, yes. He's like, all right, I'll email you. <laughs> and he just like sent me, uh, I had to like fill out some shit and I just had my card. Yeah, W. Like, it's crazy. They mailed dude. it to you? Um, yeah, they mailed me the physical card, but in <coughs> Illinois, you can get like a, like you can print it and go the same day. Damn. So, yeah. That's fucking legendary. It's pretty sick. Bro. It's pretty sick. You can literally say like your pinky toe aches and they'll give it to you, bro. Yes, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, you can say anything. You'd be like, bro, I had a headache this morning. They'll be like, damn. All right, let's get you a med card. <laughs> Yeah, for real. Sounds for like real, chronic man. pain. <laughs> Thank you guys for having me, bro. This is oh, so man. legendary. Thank you for Anyone coming on, bro. I've been hogging this hoe. My smoke bad. Smoke that mother. It's that good. Smoke that. it up, dude. That's smoke exactly it up. What I'm saying. When that did you uh, hog? How often or how long after you started smoking did you start making content? Ooh. Were you like watching it for a while first, and then you're like, I'm gonna make this? Or like, how did you even go about it? You know? So I was looking through my old videos in 2018. I made like two weed two videos just to try it out because I was fucking with. I was fucking with both you guys, like Yola, Mr. THC. Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. X-Code A, for sure, for sure. Shout out to X-Code yeah. A. Hell yeah. And then, yeah, so I was just trying it out in 20, 2018. 20, this is after high school for you? Yeah. I graduated in 17. Okay, word. Yeah. But <laughs> in fucking 2019 is when I made my Damien Luck 925 channel, and that's when I started, like, going crazy with it. Yeah, like, Uploading sure. consistently. Yeah. But what was my 2018 channel? content like? You were just posting some bullshit? Yeah, just me in my mom's garage, like smoking weed and shit. Hell yeah. <laughs> hell yeah. Hell yeah. Just That's talking to shit. It's like almost like a mini podcast, like 10, 15 minutes type shit. Yeah, like story times and shit about right, the yeah, first right. time I smoked and shit. Right, I was just right, right. testing Still. the water, see like if I was any good at it. 100%. The first videos were shit though. That's how it always is. Always. Right? No one's though. Oh, yeah. like yeah. amazing always. at it right off the bat. You know, My old videos yeah. were so But it's dog, good to get those man. videos out the way because if yeah. you don't start and try those videos, like it's almost uh, you won't you won't discover your yeah, passion. People don't want to even yeah, start. Yeah. People don't want to start because they don't want to be bad at it. But like you're it's like, bro, no, you want to. You gotta be bad at it for a while. Yeah, you learn. Yeah, you learn for surely. Trial and error. Yep. What made you start the Damien? Luck channel versus the like the whole new channel versus the 2018 content. Shit, just because it was a fresh fresh channel, it was like at zero subscribers. I had just made a Damien Luck 925 Instagram. Word. I was blowing up on Instagram first, like doing freaking weed videos, like <laughs> reels and like weak ass like 
daily hit. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Hell but yeah. there was no, so, nothing like public or anything yet, like no catchphrases, nothing, just like regular content. No, nah, like Yodi Gang and oh, okay. you saw the Yodi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, that shit was there early, but like I used to say it like weird, like I wasn't conf- yeah, like I wasn't confident with it, you yeah. know. Oh, word. But now shit, you can say bro, it whenever, wherever. But the daily hits I was doing were just so cringe, bro. I was in my mom's house, like, <laughs> blowing through a homemade sploof and shit. <laughs> it's like the dryer sheets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. With the dryer so sheets dope. and the toilet paper roll. You guys my ever man. done that? Yeah, oh, for sure. Yeah, my dude, grandma's 100%. house, bro. Regular, yeah. Yeah. It doesn't even work. It smells so bad. Nah, yeah, yeah, it does As a kid, you think it works. You're like, you're like, yeah, this is working, like, for sure. Nah, <laughs> this is not working. It's yeah. more like poison weed. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's just burnt chemicals. Yeah. It's <laughs> fucked up. That's just gross, bro. Yeah, I, try oh, to, I can like, smell it in my head. When you take the dryer sheets out, them bitches are brown. Yeah. Gross. Yeah. Disgusting. Resin on them hoes. Yeah, you try to like blow it out the window and point the fan and it still smells anyways. Like It worked though, you know? Yeah. No smell? Yeah. yeah. Worth it. A couple dryer sheets. Nah, It'll kind of nah, work. Nah, grandma was maybe. yelling at me for sure, uh, dude. Every time. Bro. I was always uh, like, how the fuck does she know? But then now I'm like in the dumb, like, man, you can't hide the weed smell. Yeah, bro, yeah. It's, it's nearly impossible to hide like like flour right. or a yes. joint. It's, it's nearly impossible. You need like a like, vaporizer, like a dab or some shit. Yeah, dabs, dab, yes. different story. You can get away with a dab. You can get away with a pen. But if you're smoking <laughs> a bong, a joint, any type of flour, you're like, motherfuckers know. They might not say none. But they know. Yeah, yeah step outside know. and smoke your joint or bowl or whatever. <laughs> yeah, real quick. Now that I'm glad you Don't mentioned open that up you the were, window and shit. <laughs> yeah. right, right? I'm glad you mentioned you were in like your parents' crib and like in your hometown. A lot of people think that they need to like move to LA and like have this crazy setup. But it's like, bro, you were just making have some fancy fucking, equipment. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, I need this ten thousand dollar camera. Right? I can't make content too. Just like phone content. Just on my iPhone, my yeah. cracked iPhone, That's and the right. audio was broken, so the audio would go. At some points, the audio would be normal. At some points, you can't even hear what the fuck I'm saying. <laughs> but still, but you were like, still doing it. Rocking with it, yeah. yeah fuck yeah. I fuck feel like yeah. a lot of people, like what you just touched on, Eric, is they get so discouraged with not having the fanciest equipment or the nicest studio to film yeah, in. Yeah. Bro, everyone, you have a supercomputer in your hands. Right. Like, exactly. Like, in your you can do yeah. anything with yes. an iPhone or mm-hmm. an, like even these, these the, any phone that's new, you can you can start a whole YouTube channel on tomorrow. Yeah. Like, yeah, you like the you thing behind yeah. you, it's just like, it's a sheet, bro. You can just get that. Like, Dead ass. Like, put it on a wall. Yeah. Dead ass, bro. Dead bro. Ass, bro. Like, like, you ain't got to be like fancy bucks. about it. You got to start though. Yeah. That's that's the thing. You have to start. And if you don't start, you're never going to have a chance at it. Like, you're gonna yeah, take sure. L's along the way, but you just gotta keep going. Those L's are lessons. Yeah, for real. Sure. Yeah, like all and of us here, we probably it wasn't like just working off the bat, you know? Right, Hell right. Nah, yeah, bro. yeah, Hell yeah. That's nah. what people no. think, is especially because like no. TikTok and people see you and they think you blew up so quick, but like people don't know you were making videos in like 2018, 2019. They, you know? It's just social media in general. They look at all of us and they're like, "Damn, they, like it was shoot, so easy for them and right, shit." You feel right. like, yeah, like, for sure. It was definitely it's a marathon. It's some shit that we have to like pursue every day just because we're in, in this position, like. It's not over. We still got to keep going after this shit every sure. day, bro. 100%. 100%. Yep. Even if you feel like you made it, sometimes it's like, nah, there's like so you much gotta, more you to You got to go, keep you know? going. It's yeah, like, yeah, gotta, there's so much more to see and do. Being creative and, you know, putting out good stuff. Nah, fuck. Hell yeah. How long did it take um, you personally for uploading content in 2018, 19 until like you saw some traction? Well, it was on Instagram, right? So my, I ran on my Instagram to like a few thousand followers really right. quickly. They were really rocking with the Instagram okay. content. The daily content? Fuck yeah. Yeah, mm-hmm. and like story posts and yeah. like just cool pictures and shit, yeah, you yeah. feel me? And then basically I made my first video. That video didn't do too well. Then the second video I made was smoking a paper plane as fast as I can. <laughs> That video got up to like 25K in like two Damn. weeks. Two weeks, bro. For that's a second amazing. video, that's insane. Yeah, that's that's like crazy. crazy. It was on YouTube. Damn, that's a Damien Love video channel. too. Yeah, it's still up too. Damn. Wow. Damn. That shit blew that's my nuts. mind, bro. And I just kept grinding, but all the videos after I posted after that one didn't perform as well. Mm-hmm. So that was like an outlier. Yeah, it was, it was the title. The, like the title and the thumbnail hit. For yeah, real, for yeah. Real. yeah, yeah, yeah. That was like a lesson though, 100%. You're like, okay, this is what hits. Like, you kind of mm-hmm. got a, like a little something in your mind. You're able to get some like, data, you know, because yeah, you're like, yeah, you're yeah, new like to this, right? You have, you have no idea like what's yep. going to work or not. So, any, any success or failures, uh, you, can, you can data collect a little bit and you're like, hey, this thumbnail worked, this thumbnail didn't work. Yeah. Were, right. how, were you able to like hone that skill in? And so now are you, are you very confident in your ability to post a YouTube video and you know it's going to be a banger? So here's the free game for the people out oh, there. Oh, okay, okay. Get, okay. Ready. get your recorders. Hey, you I gotta like get this. the application, or it's like a Google Chrome extension. It's called TubeBuddy. 
And yeah, yeah. You rate, you type a title in, and it rates it out of a hundred. And yeah. it's like if people search it in, in shit, you feel me? That shit really helped me. Once I got too buddy, and I realized, oh, I can't just like put some random ass weak title. Right. It's right, like right. the thumbnail and the title kind of matter. Even though my thumbnails are shit, like I still try to make it like a cool point in the video. Yeah, yeah, like, there's smoke mm-hmm. coming out or like yeah. something. Yeah. something. Yeah, well, yeah, you yeah. say they're shit, but they're more like they're organic. You know, these thumbnails that you see on like a Mr. Beast channel, like it's a big it's, it's, face it's a production, you know, yeah. it's this big Photoshop yeah. thing. Yours are just like, it's it's organic. It's, it's like a natural. moment in the actual video. People like, can relate to it a little bit more. So I don't think yeah. they're shit. It's just, it's a different genre of thumbnail. Exactly. You know what I mean? They're, they're sure. scuffed maybe. Scuffed. Yeah. Yeah. It has that personal yeah, touch bro, to it. I record though, my know? videos on a GoPro. This shit's for show scuffed. It's been scuffed since the beginning. The, the, Go, the GoPro quality is, awesome. is definitely... But it adds to it. It's it's, like a, it adds a little yeah. mystique to it, and it's so easy to use, too. The GoPro is fucking this big. Yeah, yeah bro. And if yeah. I walk in the store with a camera like that, they're going to be tripping instantly. Oh, it's a wrap. <laughs> yeah. It's a wrap. The GoPro, people don't even know I'm recording sometimes. Yeah, yep. yeah. When did you transition from the phone to the GoPro? Like, make that investment i guess bro in 2019 like that's when i started the channel and i was grinding using the phone up until 2022 bro three years hell yeah see i don't want to hear no one make an excuse talking about i don't i need equipment three years i was broke when i got the gopro i went to offer up spent like I had three hundred dollars to my name. I spent a hundred dollars on a fucking GoPro. Thirty yeah, yeah. percent of the yeah, savings yeah. left. So I'm yeah, going yeah. in. Yeah, let's go. I'm going in. That's dope. Fuck yeah. It's because like, bro, and I was up before that too. You feel me? I, down to my last three hundred, but I had a good savings working full time at a job and shit. Word. Fuck yeah. yeah but yeah. I lost all my money like trying to flip NFTs. Like I got lost <laughs> in the sauce. <laughs> that's just, sometimes that's the way it goes, bro. You yeah, know, yeah. You, when you when you get some money, you, you try some shit. And you yeah, learn from that, that you know. Risk, yeah. When did you I've decide to go to go shit, all dude. all in on on the YouTube though? And you're like, I this is this is what it's is gonna be. I'm, I'm gonna spend my. GoPro? Was it that GoPro moment? It was a GoPro moment, and then I saw how easy it was to blow up in like overnight because of like the Sneeko and Andrew Tate methods of like the, clips, the TikTok yeah. methods. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. And just getting like you're following to repost your clips on TikTok. Okay. And they get they get a reward for it too. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you have it's like like a little bounty system almost where you have like a an incentive for them to to participate in in the clips. Yeah. And I, I stole the method from Andrew Tate and Sneeko and people were like, Fulcrum was inspired to start YouTube from Andrew Tate. And then they're like trying to fucking get mad at me for that shit. But it's like, nah, I just stole his method. I just stole yeah, his method. Yeah, yeah. No, you were intelligent. Worked, you saw right? something that was was viral. Yeah, Anyone song. can make good sauce. Uh, right? Like, like you, you nah, saw. That's, that's, <laughs> that's a little fried nah, right there. Nah, you fried. want it, Eric, my friend? Nah, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> anyway. Anyway, maybe. No, but you, you saw something that was working. And and you were like, I could I could recreate this this concept in my yeah. in my own world and and be viral. Yeah, and, and I fucking, still do it to this day. It. Yeah, you did it. Yeah, like it, it, you accomplished that, which is is proof of more of your concept. Yeah, that that's dope as fuck. If, some, if something's out, working, fucking do it. When did the content start being public? Because I feel like that's when it also started blowing up. You know, instead of when you were filming at your mom's crib or like outside. What do you mean? Pu- oh, like, like, like in public, in yeah, public. public. Yeah, like yeah, not, yeah. not to the public, like right, 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 but in, public, in Lowe's like, type shit. Yeah, okay. Yeah, in okay. the stores and shit. Was it always like that? Or was there like a time where you're like, oh, I'm going to start doing this shit? In a Bro, King? it's always been like that. <laughs> really? <laughs> well, I mean, I guess maybe in 2019, I wasn't doing that, mm-hmm. but I think it first started in 2020, like just going to the gas station with my homie, Matthew Yee. Smoking a blunt in the 7 Eleven. Inside the store? Yeah, just to get a few <laughs> hits for the video. Because they fucked How fast they kick you out. They fucked with me. They didn't say anything. They didn't say anything? No, nah, my That's 7 so Shout out to 7 Eleven. The 7 Eleven, I poured the soda on that guy. They fuck with me. That's though. a big video. Dude. That's, That's so like a dope video. That's, That's so classic. sick. Legends. They, they never fucking hated on me when I smoked in the store. Shout out to that 7 Eleven. Legends. Damn. Damn. Big ups to them. I used to go and like, I used to work at a dispensary. The dude that worked there, he took hella down. As I just go, I get hella free product from the dispensary. Just give it to them. Go hook them up. <laughs> yeah, fuck yeah. yeah. Give fuck it to yeah. the hobos fuck and yeah. shit. Like, Maybe that tweaker never came back and they're thanking you for it. You know? they, no, they're he's happy. still around. He goes oh. back. Yeah. Have you ever, did you ever see him after that video? Nah, but someone told me recently that they still see him to this day. <laughs> someone recently told Bob. me that. He's waiting for some more free shit. Dude, that's <laughs> fucking <laughs> waiting, dude. <laughs> <laughs> That video is that your biggest video? No, my biggest video is Blinkers and Target, which is a video I filmed in like 2022. 
Hell mm. yeah. And I had like 200 subscribers when I filmed that shit, I Fuck think. Fuck yeah. And it's at like over 2 mil, yeah? Yeah, it's like 2.5, I think. That's Big crazy. Guess. So like, when, when you like go into these places and do this shit, because I mean, I've watched a lot of your videos and I've seen a lot of your clips on, on TikTok, as I'm sure probably a lot of us watching this, a lot of you guys watching this have as well. Um, do you just like not feel like, like how do you overcome like anxiety about it? Do you just not feel anxious about it or? When I was in high school, bro, I'd be like, oh, kind of like self-conscious about what people think about me. But like in 2019, I feel like I spent a month in Europe, bro. Like I feel like traveling the world and just like, which is a privilege for sure, for sure. It like yeah, opened awakened. up my mind. Yeah, like I just like. Opened your third eye op- type shit. It opened my mind and I just, fuck, bro. What was the question again? Oh, just like. <laughs> 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 how do you not get anxious i guess yeah like how do you do public? this shit without like getting yeah, nervous or like anxious that shit you know? opened my mind bro and i was like bro it doesn't really matter what people think about me bro like if i just like live my <laughs> life caring about what people think about me then i'll never accomplish what i want to accomplish for real for real true it's Hell just yeah. something i overcame bro much. yeah because like i just noticed in your videos you you just like you seem like you have no fear. Like, it's you the just best. Get into so, it, bro. It's, like it's, the one on the plane you just posted. Like, yeah, what are you scared of, Fulcrum? Dun, 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 dun. Um, shit, spiders. <laughs> oh hell yeah! I'm scared of everybody is spiders, spiders too, bro. Everyone, I, I fucking hate spiders. I make my bro. girl kill spiders. You would just yeah. Like, yeah. I, I, I swear to God, I don't, I'm not doing that shit. Oh, come on, bro. You my wouldn't girl, do like oh, a, my sister will fucking pick up the spider. No, 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 that's that's okay. No, okay, chill, chill. That's too much. That's, that's gross, too much. Man. That's just disgusting. You wouldn't do like a fear factor in a tub that pours some spiders on you. No. Would you? I would you do, do that, that for shit? money? I wouldn't even no. do that shit for money, dude. <laughs> million dollars, Eric. You getting in that tub? Million? You gotta stay in there for like five million, minutes. Man. What kind of spiders are they? Five minutes? Like, Holy shit. Yeah, wait, five minutes? They're gonna be like, it's like two songs. You got the five million dollars. It's a million dollars. You doing it or not? I'm gonna be crawling up my wreck. You are traumatized. You get five million dollars, but you're traumatized, bro. Is it even worth it? No. What if he's not that scared of spiders? What if you are overcome you scared the scared trauma? Spiders? I feel like everyone's afraid of spiders. Right? No one like really loves spiders. You I go mean, to therapy after? Yeah, you just, <laughs> you just pay for the therapy. I was in a tub right? with spiders for five minutes. The therapist just like, what the fuck? Can you pay a <laughs> pay a hypnotist to to fix you? Some people got weird like pet spiders, huh? Yeah, See, no, that shit's does. fucking not nah, really. Nah, yes. fuck oh, that's that. why she picks them up, and wow, that makes nah, sense. Nah, she Dang. keeps well, my them. My sister moved out of state, so she just left the spider with my mom. So my mom has a fucking pet spider. What? Yeah. In the middle of the house. <laughs> How big is it? The running around. It's a tarantula, bro. It's big. Yeah. 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 It's a hairy fuck shit. That. Terrifying. It's hairy as fuck, and it molds, and then nope. it grows bigger, bro. Nope. What? Yeah. They evolve they like Pokemon. Shut the not, fuck up. It outgrows its skin, yeah. and then like it looks like there's two spiders in the cage because the mold looks like a full-on spider, bro. It's like full skill, like this. It's just full. a full-on spider. Bro. Have the chills, man. That's fucking gross. That's so scary. Dude. Fucking hell, uh, Oh my it's god. It's not that creepy. They're not that like. They're not that like mean of a spider. The nah, scary the ones are the, like the black widows and yeah. shit and the gray jumping Poisonous ones and ones. shit. Oh, yeah, fuck, those are fucked. Holy yeah. shit. I guess the tarantulas, they're, they're just kind of vibing, you know? Fuck they're hairy that. and shit. That's what if they get what, do you, what do your family think about the whole thing going on? Like after? <laughs> oh shit. My mom, basically when I started and I had like less than 5k subscribers, my mom basically thought I was retarded. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> She's like, this is a stupid idea. Yeah. <laughs> she knew about it before 5k? Like, did you tell her about it or how did she even She find knew out about it? it ever since the beginning. My mom's like, cause I've been making music and okay, video since I was a kid. My mom right. knows about like everything that yeah, I do I type shit. Okay. Yeah. okay. So yeah, my mom was like, this is so dumb. What the hell are you doing? <laughs> but then she sees like, I think once I went to LA and like, People like you feel me are like hella fucking with me. My mom started yeah. supporting it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. My mom, my mom started supporting it once she saw like it going up a little. Yeah, bit. once it actually come to fruition. Like right. it could be 100%. real though, because I mean, she obviously wants the best for you. So, so when she saw it could be like maybe a career or something real. Yeah, if she my, was like, let's bro, go. Yeah, for yeah. real. If you're a parent and you see your kid doing that shit, you'd be like, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> honestly. It's getting harder. Honestly. It's getting harder though for parents to notice because I'm a, I'm a new I'm a new dad myself, and it's like. When my by the time my little baby is like growing social, it's, that's all. Everyone's gonna be on YouTube. Like, but where's so all the other it's jobs? So, then? It's crazy. Yeah. Who's gonna fix my sink? A robot? No. Kids want to be streamers and YouTubers. Now. Oh, 100 percent. Like I got little little cousins, and that's all they want to do. But if everyone you, you ask them their first, what, you ask a kid right now what they want to do. 
They, they're gonna say they want to be a YouTuber or yeah, they want to play. Really they want to be the problem though. If everyone's yeah, streaming and, and YouTube, <laughs> who's watching? The people that's that couldn't make it. Who's watching? The I mean, that couldn't make it. Now nah, they're they're probably still going. They're probably still trying because everyone else is doing it. No, nah, but there's like, phases in life because like in 2020, 2021, there's definitely moments I feel like I, I'm not. I can't. Mm, oh, exactly. definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And a lot of people quit. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Yep. yeah. Oh yeah. But a lot of those like thoughts in your head where it's like I'm not good enough. I can't do it. It's not even like. It's not necessarily truly you. You feel me? Right. Like you gotta ignore that shit and keep it pushing, bro. Yeah, for, for, for sure. For... It's like not based in reality. You're just like in your own head. You know? Yeah. You can do that. shit. You maybe right? smoked the Benjamin too many times. You got a fifteen dollar <laughs> cart from Little Mickey. You got swapped <laughs> yeah. in for some rosin or some shit. You True. Know? Yes. You know, speaking yes. of that, so I, I've seen. Are you are you still team blinkers or team not blinkers? What's the, what's the <laughs> debate over here? Bro? Yeah. What is the need to take on blinkers? Dun 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 dun. Nah, bro. Well, fucking. I, I really haven't been smoking them in my videos for the past like year or so, but yeah, I've seen you smoke. You smoking a lot of uh, well, the hash holes, right? Yeah, yeah, and like Dabington cities. I was smoking yeah. a lot of woods at one point. Okay, Mainly my views were woods. What flavor? Oh shit, bro! Fucking original. Classic. Original. Or no, yeah. I was smoking the vanilla Pop ones too. Because oh, when okay. that first dropped, they were all perfect freaking leaves. Yeah, vanilla's gas. But now I've been on paper gang. Paper planes, man. You're on the paper plane. planes. You completely gave up the blunts recently, right? Yeah, I was just, like, yeah. I just started to feel like it was negatively affecting my health. Oh, shit. You're like coughing up shit and stuff? I feel like that's what happens when I smoke too much blunts. I started like yeah, coughing up. Yeah, and I just wasn't enjoying the cannabis. I was enjoying the nicotine. I was smoking mm. for the fix mm. of the nicotine. Had to take that relationship. And it's like blunts or dabs. I'm not going to fucking smoke blunts and dabs, bro. <laughs> yeah. You know? Yeah. That's just too, that's many. Some people be doing that. Adam Hill presses blunts, smokes it. Oh, blunt, yeah. Blunt, 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 blunt. He'll literally roll a blunt and then just press it and smoke what comes out. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> yeah, literally, yeah. yeah that's no. Tobacco rosin, bro. Yeah, that shit sounds crazy. I don't know if I want to try it. I'm gonna be honest. I'll try it for the one time. I've tried it for the one time. Is it fire? How was it? It's pretty fire. Really? It's actually. Do you feel the nicotine? Yeah, you do. You do. Yeah, you do. You feel exactly like you just took the massive hit of a blunt, but it tastes good. It it doesn't taste nasty. Is the nicotine like OD feeling like a moke? Nah, it's not definitely not like a moke. It's definitely not anything like it's not even it's not even like a um a spliff. It's way lighter than a spliff for sure. A spliff Damn. Thing. Really? Yeah. So you just get like a like a good like He might be on to something. He might yeah, be on to something. I don't know. Yeah. When I tried it. Can we press some blunt rods in there? <laughs> you guys should do that for an episode. <laughs> we gotta hit up Adam Hill. We gotta bro. get one. Yeah, yeah, we gotta we get, get Adam. Shout out to Adam Hill. He'd be fucking with the movement. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Adam over to press some fucking blunt rods in for us. Gotta fuck with the movement, man. Yeah. That's motion. He's the go. W motion. Yeah, I went over uh, <laughs> did his podcast recently. He's a cool guy. Is there any marijuana on this table that I uh any yeah. pine park on the table that I can smoke? Um in Is front of Eric. Eric, you want to toss me that? I got some weed if you want. Yes. <laughs> What's <that? laughs> Oh, is this not open? Brand new. Open oh, it. Oh, okay. I've All never right. seen it in person, bro. You want to yeah. check it out, bro? Yeah. yeah. First open. Get Take a look. Get that triple Z in, man. Get that triple Z This is triple Z. Oh, I thought it was triple Z. No, That's no, 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 no. It's for show Skittles. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Show Skittles. Big Skittles. Green Dog. It's always beautiful. The Green Dog way, man. Shout out Green Dog Cultivators. I bet this whole smoking. It's oh, for it. show smoking. Yep. What's in this grinder? Does anyone Ooh, remember? Or should I like? Oh, no. Thank you. Thank you, yeah. Thank you, man. Oh, yes. If you want Thank some you of guys, this pack man. as well, we got the Triple Z Black Sherb Smarties. You can hit Ooh. the Green Thumb in San Diego, the Pottery in LA. We got Mankind San Diego, Buzz Cannabis in San Diego as well. Shout From the Earth, guy. Santa Ana. You know what I mean? Little OC actions. Good stuff right there, bro. That's good stuff right there. Shout out to Green Cross Torrance, man. Torrance, man. That's the fucking place right there. How often do you find yourself in LA? I've been, this is my second time here this month. Jeez. Damn. I used to not like coming, but shit, I'm having fun, like, yeah, I've just been having fun, like, working and shit again, Yeah, having bro. fun again? Fuck yeah. yeah. What, what do you think? There's, like, a certain thing that caused that, or you're just, like, kind of grinding again? You're like, fuck it. Just grinding like, again, you feel me? Hell yeah. What made you not, like, like it? Just kidding. Nah, it was just, you feel me? Like, like burnt shit. out? Too rat racy almost type shit? It just happened all at once, you feel me? And there's ups and downs and everything, but... Yep. Shit, I enjoyed the whole journey, you feel me? I yeah. realize it's not always going to go up. It's not always going to go down. But shit, 
I'm having fun. I'm feeling like motivated. Fuck yeah. And I eliminated bad habits and shit like before the year started. Let's go. So yeah, I really started my New Year's resolutions like before New Year's started. <laughs> oh, nice. cool. Yeah, I just got like a head start on the year. Yeah, people gotta, yeah. you don't gotta wait for a certain day, you know what I mean? Get and better. shit, the videos I was dropping, like the first nine videos, ten videos I dropped this month performed shit, bro. Mm. And then like, dude, the ten. Did you get age restricted? Po- Some of them, yeah. Damn. Wait, a lot of them were just performing shit. Like, yeah, the first one I posted after a while got age restricted. That just fucked up. Like, yeah, yeah. Right. it yeah. fucked up the yeah. whole algorithm yeah. for you, yeah. bro. Yeah, Insane, man. bro. But you can always get that shit back, though. A hundred percent. Yeah, you can always get that shit back. Yeah, yep. it's not for hard. Sure. You just gotta be consistent for real, for real. For sure, yep. bro. For and sure. And you gave me good advice last time. I was like, you've been doing this shit for a long time. What advice would you give me to like keep this shit going? You're like, keep bringing them the content that. um Blew you that up. they like yeah that right. blew you up yeah yeah don't stray like too far from it you know what i'm saying don't change up too much yeah, yeah. bro i really fucking um respect you guys and look up to you guys in a way for real for real because for real i've been subscribed since like 2018 thank I've you known about you longer than hell yeah, yeah that's fuck dope. Those, yeah. thank you guys both heavy for real for real Thank Heavy. you, bro. I, re- I really appreciate the support. It means a lot to me, bro. Yeah, bro. Thank you. And I, I, I really respect what stories. you're doing, too. Thank you, bro. Yeah. I, you know, in my heyday, I did a lot of shit. Now I just take my <laughs> shrooms and smoke my weed. And <laughs> Your stories are it. legendary, bro. Thank God you, bro. has legendary stories, bro. Like, I used to fucking stay up till fucking 3 a.m. just watching back to back to back. Like, <laughs> swear to God. Thank, thank you, bro. I really appreciate it. Faded off, yeah. faded thank off you, a man. jewel. Faded off goddamn dabs in my room and shit. Let's go. Let's fucking <laughs> I used go. to be dabbing like fifteen dollar grams of distillate and shit. Fuck. Uh, that's yeah, how we were all fuck, doing it, bro. Yeah. The the bullshit that me and my friends used to be buying when I was younger, dude. We were getting taxed on it too. Just like the right. brown BHO poop soup, and it was like 40, 50 bucks a gram. Poop Crazy. soup. Yeah, that's exactly what it was. It was <laughs> <laughs> it it kind of tasted good though sometimes. <laughs> yeah, sometimes it had a little sweet place. I was gonna yeah. say it tasted like shit because sometimes it tastes like shit, but sometimes it really tasted like kind of flavorful. Like there was some the lemon ones were good. The lemon shatters and shit. Oh, and it got you the high as fuck, back in the day, yo. bro. Yeah. Got you yeah. hooked, dude. Hell yeah. Did the good gas finally come along with like the YouTube channel blowing up and everything? Nah, not at all, because I always worked at Dispensaries and shit. Whoa! Oh, yeah. so you had the shit. Yeah. yeah. When did yeah. you start working at dispensary? I got my first foot in the door. Like it was a hole in the wall. Weed maps delivery service in 2018. Nice. Oh, nice. You're driving the packs. Driving the packs. Working at. The, I just told the story on my YouTube. He was a weird ass dude, but <laughs> he ran it out of his home. He ran the fucking delivery service out of his home. Oh, he's probably in jail by now. (laughs) Man was trapping. He's he's, he's still doing it to his day. Really? (laughs) He's doing it to his day legally. Oh, he's like legal now? He He leveled up. He leveled up. Okay, good for him. Good for him. So we like to see. He was a small business owner. Good for him. It is, man. Hell yeah. You guys got to watch the story, bro. He did some crazy shit. What's the video called? What's the video called? I stole from my boss story time. (laughs) I swooped the packs. I swooped the packs. Did he caught your ass? Yeah, and he told my mom. <laughs> and my mom's like, you better pay him back. And I was like, I'm not paying him back, mom. <laughs> What'd your mom do? She was like, well, he's over 18. What the fuck can I do? <laughs> She's like, I raised a piece of shit. <laughs> how, how, many, how much pack you get off with, though? It, like, at least a couple gram. Bro. I'll, tell, I'll tell the story about the best Whoop of the pack, bro. Okay, okay. So, that's I, so there was here. multiple. I planned this shit the night before. <laughs> oh, all right. Before. Hell yeah. So the plan Mastermind. was, I'm, his business was not booming. Like, so it'd be a lot of downtime. I'd sit around his house, and he'd be fried out of his mind, yapping about some weird shit to me, bro. Okay. And, was it? Was it just you? Were there any other employees? Nah, he had like two fresh out of high school girls working for him. Too, bro. <laughs> oh. Yeah, he had some little little fresh bitches in there. Okay, you were fresh yeah, out of high school too, though, right? Yeah, he had the Ripington shit. Yeah, he had the right people in general. But Crazy. hell nah, bro. Fucking, I planned this shit the night before, bro. And then, yeah, so I knew there was going to be downtime. I kept my backpack on the whole day because I didn't want anything to look sus, bro. Mm. We were in the garage making pre-rolls and just scaling out zips and shit <laughs> beforehand. In the car- and I made sure not to hit my vape inside the garage. Mm-hmm. We go back in the fucking living room and he's just yapping fried out of his mind. And then, God damn it, holy shit, bro. I'm like, yo, I, I think I left my vape in the garage. I'm going to go check. 
It, I'm gonna go check in the garage and see if I left my vape. He's laying on the couch type shit. I have my backpack on. We go inside the I go inside the garage, go inside the safe, swoop the packs. <laughs> swoop the packs. <laughs> I swoop the packs. Fast like payday damn near, like fast as hell, you're just grabbing them bitches. <laughs> yeah, it looked like I pressed E on the safe. <laughs> for real, for real. Literally, bro. You were locked into the animation. You were just grabbing that shit. Yeah, bro. <laughs> and then I go in, I get like four, I get like three zips and like hella eights and the hella like concentrate, and I go back in, I'm like, yo. I think I left it in my car, actually. <laughs> actually. So I go into my car with my backpack on, and I put all the packs under my car seat, and then I, I get the vape, and I go inside. I'm like, yeah, it was, it was in the car, and I hit it. <laughs> <laughs> and I go do some plan. deliveries. They didnn't find that out was like that was like a step-by-step step plan in your deck. You're yeah, like going it to played out so. perfect. Fuck One yeah, thing was moldy, yeah. bro. Oh, whoa. Yeah. He was selling the moldy packs. Oh, no. <laughs> I, sold, I sold one moldy pack. <laughs> Oh no! Was it to someone you didn't like though? What's up? Was it like to someone you didn't yeah, like? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah that's yeah, fine. That's fine. That's, fair, that's yeah. okay. Yeah, yeah fuck what you gotta do. Fuck like em. some, yeah, this scumbag. Yeah, do whatever you gotta do, then. Yeah, fuck him. <laughs> fuck him. Scumbags deserve moldy pack. Yup, a hundred percent. Bro, I, I'm a, bro. That's some scummy ass shit. What I did too, bro. <laughs> Well, yeah, you know, you chalk know, it up to the young you're younger, I feel yeah, like like yeah. I did a lot of scummy shit when I was younger too. I finessed a lot of people and shit. Um, <laughs> it's, it's just part of you know doing hella drugs. I mean, it is what it is. I feel you like know, drug addicts just do that shit. Yes, hundred <laughs> percent. Because like, bro, I was probably that was the same year I was like got into Zans and. Shit. Yeah, that, yeah, yeah, that makes sense. That'll do it. Yeah, no, that'll, that'll, fucking, yeah, that'll do it. Bro. That'll do it. Sure. Just fucked my brain up. That'll somehow. do it, bro. The Zans. Were, did you like take that'll some for work it. that day when you went in and did it? Like, no, you... I wasn't doing it then. That was like a few, like, cause I, my Zan phase was only like it wasn't that long, bro. Like, okay, it just I did it long <laughs> enough to fuck me up and make me like kind of an idiot. <laughs> yeah, but I stopped myself just in time before it got bad. Yeah, no, that's, that's good. Nice. That's good. That's Zans good. are fucked. Yeah, I remember being like sick. Oh shit! When you, when you quit, yeah, Damn. yeah, bro. The the come down's bad, dude. Withdrawals. It's really shit. bad. How long did it take you to get over that? I don't really remember. Probably like only a day or two, bro. Word. Like I wasn't on it too heavy word, type word. shit. How is it? Like you were on it heavy. I was really on and off with it. So like for me, I was always doing like multiple drugs at a time. Damn. I was never really like, oh, I'm really into Zans right now. Oh, I'm really into Coke. I was like, oh, I'm doing Coke, but I'm also like doing Molly or like popping Zans, you know? Damn. Um, and for me, when I finally stopped taking Zans, it was a thing where like, I didn't really have like the physical withdrawals where I was like tweaking, but mentally, bro, I was craving them bitches every day. And I still think about them all the time. Honestly, <laughs> honest to God, bro. I still wake up some days and I'm just like, damn, bro, Zan would bang. Damn. You know? like, damn, those little fuckers are evil, dude. Like, yeah. they're like, I don't even think about cocaine like that. And I did way more coke than I ever did Zans, damn. you know? But like, dude. <laughs> Fuck Xanax. They're, they're evil. evil. They're, they're, yeah. They are evil, they dude. Are. And they most of the time, they're like fat now. Yeah, yeah nowadays, dude, nowadays, like back in the day, it was just cut with some filler, you know? Like you were lucky. Baking you got soda or some shit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> or it was like some fake Alp, like some flu Alp or right. some bullshit, you know? Uh, nowadays, they're just fat. Like you'll, you'll just <laughs> That's die. just crazy. Yeah, it's <laughs> fucked up, dude. Dude, it is fucked up. I would never get back into it now. the best option. I did a stream with someone in... Someone got mad at me. They said, they're spreading misinformation because he said rehab's useless. It's not useless. Yeah, yeah, some people nah, need rehab. Yes, it, it does sure work rehab. for a lot yeah. of people, yeah. bro. Yeah. Some, some people, people can get, really need it. Some people can get off of it by themselves. Yeah. But yeah, yeah most people... I mean, everybody's different, though. Yeah, yeah right. most people... A lot, a lot of people need rehab. I think a lot of people should at least try treatment if they're really yeah, into it, you know? Yeah, 100%. Because you can't say you don't need it if you never tried it. If you're hardcore addicted to the point, like... Yeah, yeah, like you need treatment. hardcore addicted where you can't even help yourself. That's yeah, where you need can't treatment. Function without yeah. that type shit. Yeah, make sure to get some help, guys. But you can smoke some weed. <laughs> you know what I mean? You can smoke. You can get some help. is real medicine, guys. It actually, Damn, right. it really is real medicine. Damn right. Feel good off the hash rosin for sure. I genuinely believe it's real medicine. What's your favorite thing to smoke right now? Is it hash? Is it with flour? Are you smoking hash and some fire flour, bro? I really yep. rock with um. I got a bag full of Merkos. Oh, yeah. Okay. I got okay. the preferred. Big shout pack. out to preferred. Preferred Fuck is fire. Yeah. Preferred darts is fire, right? Yeah, Fuck I yeah. Me some of that. That was yeah. gas. That was gas. Shout out Jake's rolls as well, man. Smoking a little donut. donut. Ooh. Oh, yeah, Ooh. bro. It's crazy how small the world is, bro. The cannabis community is really tight. Yeah, it's, it's like, dope. 
everyone yep. it's like we're all locked in in some weird way for sure it's kind of crazy you start to get to know like everybody in the community pretty quickly when you start going to events and like meeting people and that kind of shit you yeah know? it's I, very tenant i really only went to that hash hole event were you there i didn't even see your ass there bro yeah what was there i was there with him the yeah bro, both of you were there bro yeah. which one 11 30 the hash hole event oh yeah we did go to we that did yeah we did go to that did you guys yeah, meet yeah. burner nah nah I didn't. no damn yeah, I just pulled up and then some sketchy kids were looking at me and my friends and shit. And we just did, bro. Uh, <laughs> they were looking at us like hella weird. Like bro. weird type yeah. shit. Damn, yeah. And yeah, LA shit. gets weird, bro. LA I just know when weird. to leave. Antioch get weird? Yeah, bro. Hometown shit gets weird. For sure, Antioch gets weird. <laughs> yeah, you gotta stay alert out here, bro. California motherfuckers, like, honestly, Keep your head all around. On a swivel out here for sure. Just weird. Yeah, you do. You just gotta pay attention. Yeah. If you have any sort of like like following, like people could recognize you, you got to pay you attention. Can't be dumb. Not everyone is going to recognize you for a good reason, you know. Like some yeah, people, truth. You know, some truth. people don't like you. at The end of the day, so you got to be aware of that. You got, you got, ops, you got, you got a lot of haters. Ops? Yeah, goblins got uh, ops. Yeah, I mean, you know, <laughs> I, get, like, I feel like ops. everyone, you know, as a content creator, the more people you reach, the more people you'll reach that disagree with you. Yeah. Um. Sure. So naturally, I mean, yeah, I get. I wouldn't say I have a lot of haters, but I mean, yeah, I get like negative comments and shit. I think it's normal. Got the opposition. You know? I wouldn't say I have like haters. You can't make you know? everyone happy. I've never, I've never like woke up and been like, oh, bro, like look at all these haters in my mentions. You know, oh, it's holy like shit. every now and then, you know, you get someone tweeting negatively. It's just part of life. Commenting negatively, that's right. their opinion. You know, someone right it's now right commenting to say that, on the you know? video like, yeah, fuck you, man. Even every, you know, on Pine <laughs> Park, every now and then, you know, you see people they talk shit on all of us on here. You know, you go 100%. through the comments, bro. You can't talking. get away from that shit. Yeah, it's just normal, bro. That's how that's how social media is. You know, it's because people leave like hate comments because <laughs> they they. They wouldn't be able to sit here and do it, so they judge other people that do it. Yeah. Like, when I was a kid, like, I'd be judging on the computer hating and shit, too. Yeah, and it's just school. easy, too, because it's just yeah. easy to just, like, there's, leave a fucking... There's, there's no recourse. Yeah, yeah like, there's no, no one gonna do nothing about it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Watch, bro, they're, gonna, they're gonna be like, damn, it is easy and flame us up. <laughs> yeah, they're gonna flame us up. They're gonna flame us up, bro. Shit. Anyone got a lighter I can bum, by the way? Sure, man. Oh, shit. Let me, let me you're done. Oh, there you go. There you go. Oh, oh thank you. you. Best believe it. Best believe it. We're about to go to Yongington City, yes, Goblin. Yes, sir. Goblin. Goblinington. <laughs> you uh, you hit the um, you hit the books and write down your catchphrases. Or how do you come up with these bad boys? They just come up to you naturally. Honestly, I feel like the catchphrases were coming, bro, when I was taking hella blinkers and my brain just had a hella metal in it. <laughs> <laughs> and so it was just like glitch, it was like glitching and producing the craziest with shit. With the metal clinking around uh, in your brain. Fulcrum, and shit. I fucking love you, man. That was, the be- that was the best thing ever right there. Was like the what me- the fuck was that? It was like that the was metal so in your brain made shit glitch and it just like came out. Was that not the greatest fucking statement ever? I crazy. fucking love that shit. The blink- hey, the blinker lovers are coming for you right now in the comments, dude. Yeah, like, it's not fucking people true. People love blinkers, bro. Dude, Dude it's like I don't have culture. anything against the Benjamins, though. Yeah, 100%. No, 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 the no, are, it's, not it's just it's stressing out the hardware. Like, if you, yeah. you're pushing it to the max all the when time. When you have a rosin pen, objectively, you should never take a blinker. It's going to taste like shit. shit. Yes. Yeah, rosin. But never you can do safe blinkers at a low temperature if it's the right If you're able to the control right the variables. Variables. Yeah. 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 But you like should, those disposable every hit shouldn't be a blinker. Every uh-huh. hit that you take, you should. But however, you even if you do it with the right, correct variables, ceramic, good quality oil, fucking low temperature, it's still not superior to like. It's not the superior way. Yeah, and that's all I was saying with that statement. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I still like fuck like blinker videos. They're fire, bro. I like blinker video. I make. I'll still make blinker videos. Oh, bro. they like, do. Yeah. YouTube loves blinker videos. YouTube loves them. <laughs> like, you, yeah, YouTube bro. algorithm says, yeah, do those. <laughs> and you know, I, I agreed with your statement too. I also stand against blinkers. Mm-hmm. I don't mm-hmm. really, you know, I you don't, don't take, take them. No, I don't really take blinkers. They hurt. Yeah, honestly, they hurt, and I'd rather like if I want that it's much pain. smoke, I'll just take two pain. rips. <laughs> like I'd rather just take two rips that are like you know three quarter blinkers, and be stoned than take like a couple go. big blinkers. You know, and then you're like your lungs are. All I can't. They're yeah. kind of cool though. They're kind of cool. Yeah, every now and then, like you, you get the right setup. It's you the know, funniest the right videos are like, like the older cats are hitting them when they're coughing. They're yeah. like, you know what I love? Like, I, I, I do love when from. when I think it's Mr. THC when he'll go up to people on on like the YouTube shorts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. or Pizza Brian does that shit. Or Pizza Brian, okay, when they go up to him and they'll fucking like, yeah, you want to hit the blinker? It's like, bro, they're fucking going. They're fucking. Choking, no, they're choking, bro. Like they're dying on the fucking pen because they're just. 
just like for like an average person to hit like a blinker on a pen. Fuck, they're cooked. They're cooked. Yeah, yeah. They're cooked. That Absolutely. They don't, they don't Yo, smoke weed. Bro, they'll be high for hours. No, <laughs> hours. Their, their whole day is fucked, bro. Like, they yeah. don't oh, yeah. understand they're what just They're on a different traje- trajectory for that day, bro. Oh, it's done. Yeah, yeah, yeah 100%. <laughs> no, it's crazy. I love those I love those YouTube shorts. Though. I think they're fucking You ever great. been too baked? Yeah, hell yeah, bro. <laughs> oh, yeah. Of course. You ever shown up? Yeah, the last time I threw up off of weed was the Zoo video, which YouTube deleted. Oh, Dang. Oh, the Zoo video? They deleted, they deleted that one? Yeah, I drank like 700 milligrams. It was, a, it was a thousand milligrams, but I couldn't finish it because I oh. just went to the bathroom and threw up at the zoo. Oh, just yeah. straight right away. Yeah. I remember that video, they bro. I remember you passed out codeine. on the bench. Oh. They said the video had codeine in it? That's what they thought it was. So wow. you got a strike or did they just take it down? They took it down, they striked me, and I was oh. banned for however many weeks uh, that's, that's, the worst that's so, how many strikes have you got that was a good before. video too that was a great video bro i'm at like one right now they expire now they, they expire now yeah they expire now they updated it they do so, expire yeah, yeah. finally so, bro. that should expires like this month i believe nice that's fire literally for the past few like forever, forever. actually up until like the past year they just didn't expire one strike didn't expire right ever the you war- had one the warning, warning the yeah. warning and then it was strikes away, that yeah. just never Right. Yeah, I feel like my warnings will never go away because I, I still have, have the warnings that. that are from like 2022. Do you have the option to? Um, There's like a class or some this, shit. Yeah, you, you, could take. you could take a little survey, and then after 90 days, it'll remove the warning. If you go to your as dashboard. long as you conform to the class, that's all. Uh, it's some. <laughs> I don't think they'll take away the warning, but it's some crazy shit. No, when you when you uh before. when you I just got my computer, warning taken away. log into your account, yeah, check your good. dashboard, Thank and you. just try it. Damn, a new one. There should be an option uh, to like go. do the course. What's this one? Mm. Who's this? Jake. Jake's. Jake's. Yeah. Oh, let's go. Shout out to Jake's Rolls. Shout out to Blaine. Shout out to fucking preferred real shit. Yeah. Yeah. The yeah, some homies. of your favorite smoke right now. You say you're the Don Merfos, the fucking preferred. Yeah, bro. What's your favorite hash right now? You got some good hash going on. Nah, bro, but I'm always smoking, like, whenever I can get my hands on the Frosties or whatever. That's word, what I word. I've been smoking, like, um... Healing Frost. I don't know. Shit. Good smoke. Yeah. Yeah, only good yeah. smoke. Man, yeah. only hash, baby. You think you're smoking more out of hash holes nowadays? You're rolling up more hash holes than anything? If I have a fuck ton of rosin, most definitely. But all this rosin I have, like, I feel like I can't even roll it up, bro. You're you think it's up. disrespectful? Do you, this is a good topic. Do you guys think rolling up, like, fire rosin is disrespectful to it? I think nah. Nah. as long as it's nah. your rosin, you can do whatever you want with it. But you know, the growers, like sometimes they'll be like, yeah, you can't, you can't way. roll that shit up. Don't let someone that. tell you how to smoke yeah, your yeah, fucking pack. <laughs> Don't let nobody tell you how to smoke your pack. What the hell? You paid for that shit. God bless America. It's your right. This yeah, is if you buy it, but sometimes country. they gift it to you and they're like, you got to just dab this shit. I mean, if it's gifted, then if like, some, you know what I'll do? Maybe, I'll, take, I'll, sure. take, I'll take a dab out of it then. Oh. Mm, yeah, blessings. Facts, facts. Yeah, blessings. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got you. Bless. I'll experience it the way you want me to with oh, a yeah. dab, and then I'm gonna take the rest. It just of smokes it. so far. like perfect. Like rosin in the joints is crazy. It bro. smells good. It tastes that good. It tastes crazy. So me personally, I probably dab the fuck out. I like to dab it. That's You're just my preference. Kind of man. But if you like smoking hash holes, why wouldn't you just roll it up? You like e-rigs like at all? What's up? Both. Do you like e-rigs at all over there? Nah, man, you don't like e-rigs. I at actually all? don't really like them, to be honest. I feel like uh, you don't get as high as not like even the puff coat with the. I kind of feel that a little bit. I feel like okay, so they have their their purpose <laughs> and their place, but I feel like they don't get you as high as a normal dab rig. Uh, uh, traditional rigs definitely get me so fucked up. Yeah. <laughs> traditional yeah. glass, these are just like fire because, bro, like. Taste it good. is a hassle, like cleaning it, and it's a, it's like yeah. a whole ritual it's a setup. to it. Yeah, yeah. this makes it, it convenient. convenient, bro. Like especially if, you, convenient. If, if you're doing anything convenient, besides bro. just smoking, like you gaming, you watching a movie, you yes. out and about. Yeah. E rig wins exactly every yeah. battle. Yeah, but like at the crib in my smoking station where I'm just chilling, got a station going on. I'm fucking smoking the dab. At the station. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, we sit. We got the desk ready. We're fucking torching up. That's Fuck fire. Yeah. Oh, but if you're out and about, there's no way you want to do any of that. Mm-hmm. Like you don't want to fucking bring a torch around. That's fucking yep. weird. Or if you live with like anybody else that don't smoke weed and you got a flamethrower fucking out, <laughs> you look like a crackhead. <laughs> True. Yeah, it like, is a fucking flamethrower. It's for damn sketchy. Dabs like, yeah, are nuts. So the man. e-rig, the e-rig definitely has. Someone told me they were smoking <gasps> perks out of a puffco. Damn, wow. that person is sus. Wow, that's fucked. That person that is, is mad that's sus. Smoking <laughs> yerkies. That's wild. that's crazy. The thirties in the puffco. That's but so the fake crazy. Ones. 
With yeah, fentanyl. I mean, he's yeah, smoking, they're not, no one's smoking fit in the fucking Yeah, they're all smoking so the fin bad. 30s. They got it for like five bucks. What a bad choice. <laughs> might be epic, might be shit. And nowadays, people just knowingly buy the fake ones. They want the fake ones. That's yeah. the problem. Dude, like, yeah, they're buying you know, like, they, back in they the day, say it was they like, smoke oh, fit. I hope like, it's I not fit. And the plug would lie to you and be like, oh, they're <laughs> real fucking People are saying, well, sometimes they open. know it is and they just like it. They, their drug of choice is fan. Yeah, yeah. People now, that's the that's the craziest part. Like, people now want the fan. They're like, oh, yeah, I want the fake perk. Like they wouldn't even buy it. Really. There's some people who That's never so had crazy. a real perk, and they they just started off with the the fat one. You yeah, guys, see, you guys crazy. seen these yeah, motherfuckers doing the the trank drug in Philadelphia? Trank I saw is that. Yeah. Crazy. What yeah. the actual trank trank channel five, bro? That's what channel I saw, five. bro. Yeah, that shit had people. my brain fucked. It was like. The, Creating like a like a skin eating disease. That guy like permanently tripped. Bro, that looks so crazy. Bro, I had to turn it off. I was like, I'm about to puke. Yeah. <laughs> like, I this looked shit away is, from the computer. This shit for is for nasty, bro. Like yep. it was it was gnarly. They're just doing like trank, horse tranquilizer mixed with fentanyl. That's what they're taking. And their t- their skin's turning yeah, so like reptile, like crocodile saying, skin. Yeah, and they're saying they're moving there because the drugs are so strong you can't get this high anywhere else. What? That's yeah. crazy, bro. Yeah. That's crazy. And the people out there, like, you watch them, and they're just, like, normal-ass people who just turned into, like, zombies off this shit. It literally you know? like, it's, like, it's terrifying. Like he said, like, a crocodile skin, bro. Yeah. Like, it's crazy, terrifying. Bro. It's like, no up. moisture to it at all. Like, it was yeah. ugh, gnarly. Yeah. Fucking horrible. Drugs are bad, MK. Drugs are fucked. Drugs are bad, bad, man. You been doing shrooms for welcome? I do shrooms, you feel me? But the last time I did it was in Hawaii in Ooh, July. Hawaii. Wow, that's a vibe. That's a vibe. I, I just told, awesome. I just told Gaum before we started the podcast, I like doing shrooms, but like after I do it, it's not like I want to do it more. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. You yeah. only need one kind of thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then maybe like a few times a year, I'll, I'll hit that hoe. Right, right. Yeah. yeah, you can't be doing it too crazy for surely. Like when you say you do shrooms, are you taking like a like a big dosage? You're taking a small yeah, little dose. When or? I first started doing shrooms, I thought that shit was cool. Like, but nah, nowadays I'll do like a gram. Yeah, or two yeah. Grams. there we go. Yeah. Two, yeah. Grams. two grams is like a great trip dose. You're not a gram. That's, like a that's chill intense dose. for me. Two grams is that's intense. A lot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're gonna be vibing hard because there's also nowadays too. Like when you I was see a, shit morphing and shit. When mm-hmm. I was a kid, man, yeah. there was like one kind of mushrooms, bro. Like you would like get the golden. Yeah, the shit's better now. Now there's like. Motherfuckers is growing every different strain They're of mushrooms. Like top shelf and yeah, mushrooms. it's, yeah, it's yeah, no, exotic shrooms like, yeah. now. You don't need crazy. to eat fucking ten grams of mushrooms, bro. Like you're gonna fucking lose your shit if you do that. You, you fucking have puke, a gram, like you said. bro. Like yep. Yeah, yeah but you end up on the floor of your bathroom and you, your friend has to come save you or something. Yep. You know, like you gotta be careful out here. You gotta be careful. Hundred <laughs> percent. <laughs> oh, Sefo. <clears throat> You're the hash hole, man. Holy shit. Yeah, that thing is fucking I'm blowed crazy out my goddamn it mind. Woo! Yeah, I'm That cut. ash I'm looks insane great. on there. That thing was like white. Come on, yeah. that ash, dude. Nah. We're trying that, to keep that's, it that's oh, time. my. I always wonder, like, is that bad Eddie? I don't really care. I have no fucking There's clue. There's definitely a time where it's too early to ash. But, like, I, yeah, I, I, I have think no that clue. was a good point. Yeah, to that was a good point. Because at some point, you want to see the hole, right? You want to see the hole in the ash. Yeah. You want to see it. And that's just when you can see, like, the white rosin in the middle. Yeah. Yeah, that's a good... Bad rosin, you can't really see it in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's, how you, that's sure. a good test, honestly. Yeah, that it's is. a good test. Does it burn? Does it burn good in the hash hole? Mm-hmm. So when you started your channel, did you have like a certain goal in mind or are you just like, I'm a fucking start uploading videos? Or are you like, damn, I'm going to live stream with Wiz fucking Khalifa one day? You know? Bruh, for some reason, I always knew it would work. Ever since I was a kid, I told my dad in like sixth grade, I'm going to be a YouTuber when I grow up. He's like, damn. it's not really realistic. <laughs> well, look at me we'll now. see motherfucker we'll see look at me now <laughs> I love my dad he's very proud of me you feel yeah. shout out yeah. to my dad shout out to my mom yeah. they're gonna watch this shit probably let's go yeah, yeah. Awesome. shout out to mom and dad that's lit man Mr. and Mrs. Fulcrum Thank it's you. nice though to be able to be like hey I did it Check this out. I made I made this a success, and I'm gonna right. continue to keep doing that. Yeah, awesome. they're proud. You know they're, I mean? they're glad it worked out. They didn't want to see me like fucking. 100%. They didn't want to see it not work out. No, of course right. not. Right. you know. Right. Yeah. Right. 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 So they're, they're it's very a blessing happy. though. It's awesome. It's a blessing for sure. Yeah. Fuck yeah. When did you go from? Uh, do you remember when you quit like your job to do Ooh. content full time? Yeah. So that's a, that's a good top talking point, bro. Because <laughs> in the no jumper interview, I said I quit. 
They, I said in the No Jumper interview, I was making $4,000 a month at the dispensary, which wasn't true. I was just fried out my mind. <laughs> I, was, I was making $2,000 a month at mm. my job at the dispensary yeah, full time. So half of what you, you, you said. Fuck. Yeah, so. It's all right, though. You one, know? Once I started making like, like $1,500 a month from YouTube, that's when I quit my job Hell and just yeah. went all in. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're yeah. like, I'm fucking out. I could do this. Right, yeah. right, right. right. How long did it take you to make that 1500 Oh shit, bro! Once I started doing the TikTok competitions, bro, I raised my channel from 1k to 5k, and yeah, that's it. It was really easy. That was only like a month or two. Word. 1k to that was probably just one month. Right. Yeah. From 1k yeah. to 5k, and then 5k to 100k was fucking like two weeks. Hell yeah! Then you just put. Did you even put in your two weeks, or you just quit? I quit. I never put a two weeks in at my job. I've had, yeah, I've had so many jobs I since I was sixteen. Never put in a two weeks either. either. Yeah. Me neither. Yeah. Me neither. I've never put a two weeks. I, I swear, I put in a two weeks once and just Bro, left the next day. It's so easy. <laughs> it's so like, easy actually, to get another job, though. You I, feel me? Like, sure, fuck the sure. experience. Yeah. Fuck that experience. I, yes. Yes. I mean. I feel like nowadays it's a little harder to get a decent job. My like dad decent. taught me how to get a job and they taught us in high school how to come in, like make a good first impression, like bring a cover letter, make a good resume and just like make a good impression and show them how you can provide value. Yeah. yeah. yeah provide value. hundred percent. Sure. You could get an interview tomorrow if you're like, damn, I'm unemployed. I'm a loser. I'm a bum. I can't get a job. You could get an interview tomorrow, motherfucker. What the hell? <laughs> What are you talking about, folks? Let them know. No, yeah, Let them know. yeah. I guess it also depends on about. where you live. Yeah, where you live. Yeah, for yeah. sure. Like, but, it depends I mean, on where you live. There's still something. There's something. You, can go you, can go get, you could go get There's something. There's definitely something that you don't want to do. You could do, get but some it's motion. That, yeah. Yeah. Right there. There's yeah. online right there. jobs, too. Yeah. Online mm -hmm. jobs. Right, 100%. There's, yeah, always, there's always jobs motherfuckers don't want to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Like, bro, like, I quit my job. My mom be like, why would you quit your job? It's like, mom, I'll get another one. And then, like, a week later, I fucking feel that. <laughs> I feel that, dude. I just <laughs> quit my job so much. Head. Quick break in the action to give a shout out to our sponsor of today's podcast episode, Prize Picks. This one means a lot to me if you know anything about me. You know I like to hit the daily fantasy sports platforms, and Prize Picks is the number one in the entire community. You can place your picks on a variety of things, including the NFL, which has a little something coming up called the Super Bowl. All you got to do is pick more or less on your players and you can double up, triple up and five times up to your money. But what I've been using it for personally a lot, you can place your picks on a lot more than just professional sports like the NFL or NBA. I've been using it personally for Call of Duty. You can do it League of Legends, a lot of other esports. There's college sports as well. A whole lot of places to put your picks. <clears throat> One of the best things that Price Picks does that no other platform does, to my knowledge, is it has a reboot policy. So if you have a five pick entry and one of them goes kaput, say a little injury happens, that four picks is still on. Your entry is still on, baby, which is what I like to see. That's just saving you money. All you got to do is go to pricepicks.com slash pinepark and use our code pinepark, that's P-I-N-E-P-A-R-K, to get yourself a first deposit match of up to $100. So you put in 50 they'll give you 50. You put in 25 or 10, they'll match that up to $100. That's a free $100, baby. That's prizepigs.com slash Pine Park. Quick break in the action to give a shout out to one of the longest running sponsors on this show, Purple Rose Supply. You guys know them. Check out this mold. The number one cannabis cigar molds on the market. Maybe the only ones that do four different sizes, man. We got anything from one gram all the way up to a half ounce and you can get yourself smoking bro we're not talking about 10 20 30 minutes smoke we're talking about an hour plus maybe even longer just off of a few grams bro it's a perfect party occasion or if you just want to get down by yourself you can get them and they're looking good the purple color you know purple is my favorite color man so big shout out to purple rose supply get yourself some cannabis cigar molds put some pine park in there and oh man you're gonna have yourself a good time you can go yourself to purple rose supply.com slash pine park that's P-I-N-E-P-A-R-K. You should know how to spell it. Make sure to get yourself a little cannabis cigar mold. Thank you, Purple Rose Supply. Damn. They were all equally shit. <laughs> Honestly, they were all equally shit. No matter if it was the grocery store, dispensary, Starbucks, fucking weed delivery. Like, bro, they were all shit, <laughs> It's all the same. Like, KFC just... was definitely the worst. KFC. KFC, KFC sounds brutal. <laughs> I did shit. Wendy's. For real, that sounds brutal yeah. too. Uh, I only did it for like a month and a half. Just fast food in general. Yeah, yeah. fast I was at, food I was sucks. At a year at when at KFC. Oh. Damn, I was at like 
I, I want to salute you, like bro. I didn't, get a, soldier, bro dude. I didn't get a single break. I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> what the fuck? I just thought I was made cool. that chicken for eight fucking hours. <laughs> I just thought it was cool because I was like getting money and for shit. For sure, for sure. You get a nice little check, spending all like weed and food, and you're like, yeah. Just like, have like, like some pros and out. shit. <laughs> Just being yeah, like yeah. supreme and shit. Bro. <laughs> so lame, bro. It's just so I remember lame, when bro. I was in high school, my friends used to buy fake Supreme and the then ranch. try to pass it on StockX. Wow. They would like so send a just... bunch of shit into StockX and some of it would actually get through. And you, saying, you know what's right, a W bro. play? It, huh. Back in fucking 2015, 2016, the grilled play. Oh, grilled, bro. bro. The shoes and shit. Selling, you're just selling shit whatever on pieces. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, but like not even shipping anything. <laughs> That was a big thing. Or sending fake drip and getting like five hundred dollars for like a twelve dollars fake guy. <laughs> they were doing that heavy, bro. Dude, for sure. It's cool. still around. Yes. Wow. Oh, I fuck. fucking bought a two hundred dollars shirt on Grail in like twenty sixteen. Yeah, it comes to my door as like a ten dollar Chinese fake ass. Mm-hmm. It was like obviously <laughs> fake, like they're yeah. even trying to be real. Not even close. <laughs> Not even close. <laughs> well, I didn't know. I sent it to my friend. I was like, "Can you like legit check?" He was like, "This is <laughs> faker than all." Yeah. <laughs> It was, yeah, bro. That shit was so lame. Damn, bro. It's harder to get away with that now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they now all those platforms have restrictions and like refund protection. They don't give you the money immediately if you're the seller. Yeah, true, you true. Know? But true. back in the day, yeah, you could sell right. shit and just get your money like instantly. instantly. Yeah, bro. <laughs> yeah. What a crazy time. What a time. <laughs> Even on eBay, you can finesse too. eBay used to be sketchy, huh? Now it's like, bro. Oh, yeah, yeah, now eBay is valid because they right. have a bunch of seller protection and shit. But like yeah. back in the day, bro. Oh my god! Oh, you could do some man. bad things. We're talking about GTA role play. We're not even talking about real yeah, life. Re- yeah, GTA role play, fucking finessing. GTA six. Role There's a few servers nuts, you could huh? do this on. You know, we're on the Earth server. You mean Cyber so. GTA six? Hell yeah, I want to play it, bro. I'll play it on stream. Fuck we gotta yeah, play man. fucking GTA six RP when that comes out. I'm with you. Hell yeah, bro. Imagine how futuristic that's gonna be, dude. Be inside that shit. That's gonna. Be how long do you think it's gonna be? Until GTA 6 RP is out. Comes out after like the game. Probably like. Where's the game is RP? What? Well, it could be because they bought the company that right, uh, so that insane. makes like all the the RP. They shit. bought Five M. Yeah, yeah, they bought Five M. No bro. fucking. No, way. I swear Rocks to God. Bought no, you can look it up right now. They bought Five M. Yeah, nah. I swear to God. So that's the direction they're taking GTA Six. I'm calling it. Yeah, yeah they're gonna uh, with multiplayer's got to have some RP feature in it. Or so something. I feel like day one is that's what it's gonna be. Bro, that's gonna be so. I mean. You're gonna be RPing with like little twelve year olds and shit. Like it's gonna be so cute. He's gonna be like, hey, like, I'll just shoot you in the face. What are you gonna say to him? <laughs> I'll be like, fuck you, kid. Is he I'll streaming or like him? That's what it depends on. Oh, oh, is he yeah, streaming? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that's the that's the truth. Are we yeah. Not? Is there any true, is there any live true. mics here? <laughs> fuck. I'm like, are you goblin? No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> just leave the lobby immediately. <laughs> He'd be like, no, I'm Sneeko. <laughs> <laughs> you play any other games? I've been playing the finals. It's kind of lit. Oh, oh bro. Aaron's playing that shit. I haven't like played it finals. yet. Yeah, like me too. Finals, it's really fun like that? Yeah. It's cool, but here's a good question someone asked me. Do you think it will be around in a year? People will still be playing it? Maybe not. But I don't know. It if has they keep potential. Updating it, if they keep updating it and like... It has potential. Yeah. They just got to have like new maps keep. Bro, it's a cool little platform. I made I guess. my character trans. Nice. Oh. Is that a W? Kinda. <laughs> it's so fire. I fuck with it. You're full of the controversy. I heard you tweeted some real controversial shit the other day, man. People were yeah, fucking going oh, crazy. You tweeted, on it. Um, People were crazy on it. I mean, do you want to share your thoughts on the, like what you were saying about it? Man, I've said it all the time. You feel me? Like I said it hell long ago and stuff. I feel yeah, like yeah. it's not okay to say on the tube. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Because they, they'd be tripping about this on the tube. True, true. Yeah, you're right. They probably wouldn't want to hear this, you know? Well, the vid is great about it. So the is they crazy. can find it there. And yeah, I've talked about it on Sneeko's podcast and stuff. <laughs> was that, that your first time, like, with a lot of backlash, I feel like, where you were like, oh, shit? Um, yeah, I feel, yeah, for sure, for sure. It was after <laughs> the Sneeko podcast. <laughs> Oh, the single podcast when you go, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because people were like, like, who you were hanging out with trying to like dictate that. That's kind of weird. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. That is a little weird. Right. They're like, don't hang weird. out with him. Like, what? Bro, <laughs> it's just the internet. You feel me? Like, I only use my platform. I don't want to tear down anyone with my platform or like yeah. All right. bring down anyone. Like, my message is about like, no matter who you are, no matter what age you are, no matter what size you are, no matter what color you are, 
you could truly accomplish whatever you want if you put your energy and drive in the present moment Hell and yeah. make the present moment your bitch, you feel me? And that <laughs> applies to everyone, you feel me? Now, will everyone unlock their full potential? <laughs> nah, the sad reality is no. But if you truly want it, you can go out and get it. And it's really easy. It's really easy, Yodi family. You or just the, the viewers, you yeah. feel me? Y'all can motherfucking do it 100%. Yeah. If like yeah. some weird skinny Asian kid like me can do it, then you could do it too, bro. For real, for real. Times two. True. Like times two. <laughs> we can all do it. We can all do it. Yeah, let's do, go. Do, that's fucking know? tight, man. That's fucking tight. Yeah. But that's what the real message is. You feel me? Like the controversial shit. I feel like it really only takes place on Twitter. Nowhere, nowhere yeah. else. Twitter's yeah. not even Twitter's real. Like Twitter's like a, not a real place. I feel like, bro. Yeah. Twitter bro, is like a lot of these platforms like are so different. Of like, yeah. Twitter like you, like, you go to Twitter, it's super different. You go to Instagram, it's like. You go to the like real Twitter comments, and Reddit bro? are like not real. Zone, Twitter and Reddit bro, are fucking like comments Reddit's, on Reddit's Instagram are a sure. war zone. Dude, Reddit's crazy. <laughs> it's, it's crazy. People say right. the most out of pocket stuff on the Instagram comments, bro. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, Instagram comments are crazy. Like, like real people, comments are people hilarious. People comment, be like, I will fuck you. Like, like <laughs> people are crazy. <laughs> like, yeah, I'm going to be at your house today. Like, Literally, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah like, people are like 50,000. 50,000 likes. Yeah. Is crazy. <laughs> IG is so nuts, and TikTok is like you can barely post anything, bro. What we do is so crazy, bro. Can't yeah, you, you know it's a uh, wasn't even a thing. Like, what did you think you would be doing right now if you were born like forty years ago? You know, um, shit, like anything really for real. <laughs> right, for that's real. A, yeah, like, just like shit, anything. I could like. Well, my grandpa, my grandpa's an engineer. You feel yeah, me? Yeah. Like, oh shit! Maybe some shit like that. Like what we do, like we use our intellect in a crazy way. You feel in me? A creative way. But like, if sure. this, we use like one side of If this our shit wasn't here, we would use our intellect in a different way and our 100%. and our fucking strengths in a different way. Hundred percent. Yeah, I like to say, like, no matter what situation, like we would have got it, no matter what, you know. Yeah, fact. Like, we would have worked. I mean, this is work. We're still working. But working right now. I'm grateful. I love what I do. Hey, like yeah, I was dude. saying yesterday, like like when that I travel, cool. it's for work, but it, I still call it a vacation yeah. because it's still fun, bro. Like yeah, I don't even think like consider this work because it's like fun, bro. Yeah, yeah it's just chill. Just chilling. Chilling. Yeah. Just chilling. Yeah. with the homies. Yeah. Yeah. Even that stream yesterday was like big work. Event, it was fun. It was like, bro, it was like it was fun. fun, fun. Bro. It was like that shit was not work, dude. That's yeah. what, yeah. what I'm saying. How was that, bro? What was like? Was it? Did it blow your expectations out the water? Like, what were you even thinking going into that? Like, how did you? think I was like, is he gonna flake on me? Like, he flaked Neon. Neon, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the discourse right now. A bunch of El Neons. Get wrecked, kid. <laughs> Y'all fuck with Neon? Get fucking. Um, I, I don't really, I'm indifferent. I don't really Does watch anybody him. Does fuck with Neon that's above the age of fucking like 15? He called me a lame Chinese. What? what? Yeah. Like, Never not mind. but seriously, though. Like, it's El Neon. Yeah, well, okay. Well, I, yeah. I, 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 honestly, I fuck with Neon. He just needs like good guidance and shit. For real, for real. Like, really, I can't though. tell if like the character he plays is like, I can't yeah, tell. Is he really like that or is that like how he's getting streamed? I don't know. He's funny though. I think he's funny. Okay. He's funny. I think the moments are funny. Like the moments he creates are definitely funny. Yeah. Like he plays into it for sure. Bro, he fucking um, broke I think it's the a character. Internet. It's a character. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He it's a character for sure. And you can't deny it. He like figured something out, bro. My bad. Should I have this yeah. on the coaster or something? Nah, no, no worries. Bro. You okay. can put it wherever you, you want. Put it wherever. It's coaster. <laughs> you do whatever you like with it. Bathing in a goddamn yeah. hole. You feel me? Yeah. Yeah. Shit. Yeah. Bathing hole. Bathing hole. Bathing hole. Bathing hole. Bathing hole. Best believe it. Simple. Yeah. I was streaming on kick. You focus streaming on kick. Yeah, it's lit. I like I like kick. Just because, bro. YouTube they demonetized me in February, and I used to have a lot of memberships. We used Word. to have the bro. donation they can do the emotes, and then the little yeah. Yeah, and it wasn't about the money. It was just more about the community, community. you create. It's a community aspect. And they took they, they stripped it from me. So the fact that like we're rebuilding it and we're seeing like actual growth is fucking mind blowing, bro. I could make I could shed a tear. Dude, it's crazy. I love that. It's you crazy. Yeah. Yeah. Twelve and a half thousand last night was the was the peak. I mean, I, should, I, yeah, yeah. I tuned in. There was like twelve thousand people there. Holy that's shit! Yeah, yeah, that's crazy. Crazy. Front, front crazy. page, bro. first person that you saw. Yeah, it was the first yeah, actually, that's you were just crazy. Yeah, it was yeah, that's freaking that's crazy. crazy. It was fucking lit. Fuck, Shout out to everyone who pulled up to that. Stream, and it was, bro. it was a vibe too. Like uh, in the beginning of it too, I was watching when he pulled up. It was just you guys talking, and, and mm -hmm. he, Wiz was enjoying himself. You know, like there's been times where I'm sure you know rappers are in these situations where they're like, "Hey, go hang out with this person," right? And they're like, "Fucking, it's like awkward and fucking weird and boring." He was, was vibing. Vibe, yeah, he was fucking yeah, vibing, bro. Yeah. Like, so just big, big, big shout out to you, man. Big 
tip to you, man. You did a great job on there. It was fucking, it was an, it was a good stream to watch as a viewer. Thank you, man. I appreciate yeah, it. I enjoyed 100%. it. Yeah. How did that yeah. come about? Oh shit, bro. Somehow my manager got tap. Oh, so my manager knows Riff Raff and cool. Riff Raff connected Wiz's management management with with yeah, my man. manager. Shut yeah, up, yeah. Riff Raff. Hell yeah, yeah big the Riff Raff. Wiz apparently pieces. fucked with the videos and shit. Word. Yeah. That's super fire. He said he watched a few of them and he fucked with them. <laughs> That's dope as hell. I wonder dope. which ones he saw. You think, yeah, he saw, you think he saw me shit my pants in the right. <laughs> shit pants? He said he, he said he watched some of the viral ones, so that he yeah, yeah, watched the shit pants. He's like, I gotta meet this guy. Like, I, <laughs> I bet you it was you throwing the drink too, and he was like, he's a real one. Oh. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's, that's a good two first impressions. Like, he's funny and he's real. That's crazy. <laughs> what videos dope. you guys think he watched? Yeah. Ooh. It's gotta be those. Comment. Man, that's dope. That's dope as My fun. Minecraft parody songs, maybe. <laughs> I'm on this server. Did you ever try to do a gaming channel or anything? Yeah, middle school. Word, same, same. That's same. how what everyone game started games with that feel. Minecraft. We did COD documentaries. Dope. Oh, I mean, I, I, my biggest games were World of Warcraft and League of Legends. Hell yeah. And Minecraft for sure, for sure. Nice. I put yeah. thousands of hours into all three of those games. Minecraft. World of Warcraft, Go AB. You're you fucked with that shit too? Yeah. Game, Hell bro. Yeah. Were you bored? Uh, I played both. So uh, I switched to like, depending on the expansion. Said, oh. But wait, which expansion did you play? Bro, I started to miss a Pandarian shit. Oh, fuck. Did you play earlier? Miss, I was Horde though. Miss? Uh, okay. Yeah, I played, uh, I started in Wrath. Um, Damn, you played early. I got on like Kings. in fucking eighth grade middle school. That's when I started playing heavy. And then into summer, into freshman year, and then I quit freshman year, started listening to like Chance the Rapper and shit. <laughs> <laughs> That's the way it goes, bro. I'm trying I, yeah. to get swag and like mess with the hoes and bro, shit. Bro, that era was crazy. That was like the Taylor Gang era almost Dude. a little bit after that. <laughs> Listen, the bro. With the fucking swag Wearing the, everything, the bro. Diamond Supply Co shirt yeah, and the yeah. fucking, the like tan, like khaki pants to school, bro. you were the guy. The bro. cargo? Yes, pants. the cargo. The snapbacks, bro. the snapbacks. If, if you had a Come snapback, on, a Diamond Supply Co shirt, and no Bay <laughs> shirt, and some cargos, you were him, bro. The kicks, that was like, that was what were the shoes? What, what was like in? Was like it Jays for so, bro. Yeah, yeah, I guess it was probably Jays. Jays for sure. Just like some, yeah. Damn, that early week. What an era, bro. Yeah. What an era. Did you ever watch a day to days back in the day? Whiskey Honestly, I never. I didn't get into it until I started smoking weed heavy. Oh yeah, hundred percent. Because yeah, I used to 100%. think weed I didn't was. Watch it. I didn't yeah. used to think weed was like an evil drug. Really, mm. I genuinely used to think so. Like from what your, your parents, parents tell you, shit, yep, yep. Or what they tell you in school. Yeah. yeah, yeah. What made you start it? Like, who were you with, bro? Like when I was fifteen, like we were, we were in Bur- we were in San Francisco, and my I was with my dad and my mom, and my dad. My dad comes out this fucking cannabis store. He's like, I got to show you guys something. He's got a card. Oh. And I was like, damn, my dad smokes weed. He's like, and I was like, damn, my dad's a fucking drug. <laughs> <laughs> I was disappointed in shit. I was disappointed in shit. And then like, after that, shortly after that, I found out like my younger sister was smoking weed too. She oh, was younger sister, younger yeah. than you? She was like 13, man. What, what the so yeah. fuck? How old were you? You were like 16 at the time? 15. 15, oh. shit. And then I found out she was, and then just like, Cool. Realized it wasn't that up. bad. It was like because I was watching X Code A and shit. You feel me? Like, <laughs> I've been fucked with X Code A and like, bro. Even yeah, when like I did smoke, YouTube, yeah. But like, I just fucked with him like like a guilty pleasure type shit. Because <laughs> like, shouldn't be watching this. I was like, yeah, 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 like, yeah, yeah. I was like twelve or thirteen. Hey, hell yeah, yeah, no, I feel that. Was that twelve or thirteen? Nah, I was probably watching X Code A twenty four, like twenty thirteen. Right when I was a freshman, I feel that we were still smoking, like rolling, like blowing that guy on the camera. Yeah, because I wasn't and shit. smoking yet. I wasn't smoking yet. Right, but I was like, right. damn, this is fucking dope. And I, was, I want to say he influenced me, type shit. You feel me? But yeah. like, once I learned my fucking dad and my sister were, and then my friends started to, damn. like all my friends used to be like, fuck weed, fuck that shit. They yeah. started to do it, and I was like, oh hell, then they're doing it around me. <laughs> like, you know, it's like, bro, I ended up doing it too. Did you like hold out for a little bit? Like they were smoking in front of you and you were like, nah. nah. Yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> Damn. Hell How long yeah. did it take for you to like, all right, finally I'll fucking smoke. Finally. Probably like a year. Damn. That's a long time. Yeah, it's a yeah, long you time. Have that's a long time. Like, nah. Nah, I'm probably fucking, it was probably less than a year. Yeah. 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 Honestly, it was probably less than a year. <laughs> But no, I realized that, like it wasn't that bad, but I don't condone smoking if you're under the age of like you're underage, you know? Yeah. Yeah. 
it's not good for brain development. Nah, Even though we all did, bro. We all yeah, we, we all did, did it, but you should chill on it. Yeah, I'd you go know? back and maybe wait a year or two like, longer. Chill, chill, chill. Hey. Yeah. Let that let that little brain grow, okay? Mm-hmm. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly, man. Shit. Yeah. Shit. Nah, that's good smoke right there. One hundred percent, man. Let's fucking go. We had some good smoke today. I'm cooked. Bro. Hell yeah. I'm ready for another dab, actually. I'm mm-hmm. chilling. Yeah, let's get some. 3D Excellington. Bro, Puffco shows a lot of love. You uh, performed at the recent PuffCon, yeah? That was yeah. dope. Yeah. yeah. That's fire, bro. That shit That's was so fire. lit. How was your tour, man? I know you went on tour, too. Damn, was that, that was your first tour? Yeah, that was my first tour, bro. bro. So the What's first show I did, tour? the first show I ever performed, it was it was cool. Like, real ones pulled up, but the crowd, there was like four, like ten people in Fuck it. Fuck, yeah. And so it was like weird. Real, it was geez, weird. Shit. My mom was there. All my like day one homies were there, too. That's fire. But then my second show in Philadelphia opened up for like Maddox and like Bloody Clip and all these underground artists that are super lit, you know? Word. And that show was so lit and they showed so much love. The crowd was going crazy. Hell yeah. So after that first show, were you like kind of nervous? You're like, oh fuck. Like maybe this yeah, won't be as lit as I thought it was going to be. Yeah, yeah, one. yeah, yeah. But it was just a learning experience. You Hell yeah. me? It Hell wasn't yeah. really a concert. Like right. I, I performed at a dispensary. Oh, oh shit. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. But Damn, the tour was lit, bro. Yeah, like, fuck yeah. Yeah, we, I saw people, I saw you shutting it down in some venues. That was sick as fuck. You said two cities sold out? Yeah, fucking, like one did. We sold out Oakland. New York damn near sold out. Like mm. over 300 people came to both shows. That's sick. That's, That's sick, sick Yeah, okay. That's super It was lit. so crazy. And in, in New York, they were singing all the words, bro. Yeah. I'm like, yeah. how the fuck y'all know these songs, bro? <laughs> That's crazy. That's sick it's as fuck. It's so song. crazy. They knew like songs I made. Like they knew the worst of songs I made when I had... 150 subscribers making songs in my mom's garage and shit. Yeah, like, yeah. They're they singing all the words and shit. Yeah, because like when, when I blew up, they like went back and just fucked with all the old right, shit. Right, right, right. That's super dope. New York's a cool place, bro. Was that your first time in New York? Nah, my first time in New York was in 20, 2022 November. Ooh, okay. What'd you go out there for? I'm trying to th- right now. I just went out there for fun. It was my friend Brusho. Shout out to Brusho. You feel me? He was throwing a concert. Yeah, yeah. And I pulled up. New York. Yeah, I had just bro. seen you like right before I went to New York. I was we gonna say yeah, that was my first time in New York too. It was November 2022, I think. Fucking, I'd seen you in Vegas for BizCon. Oh, okay. And okay. then I took a flight. Oh, yeah, I took yeah. a flight from there to New York. Yeah, that you was my me that. first time there. And I went to the Nintendo store, and like 50 plus Yodi gang members showed up. And Ooh. no one even kicked us out. Like, it was a vibe. <laughs> Damn. It was a fucking vibe. The, the workers were vibing with it. And everyone was just following me around the store. <laughs> like, 50 plus people and shit. Is that when you were... There was, like, one time when you were walking around, like, the mall, right? And they were all following you into, like, each store? Oh, that was not a good time. Dude, I remember they were, like, <laughs> causing some shit in you. Like, Yeah, wait, what happened? Sh- bro, I did a fucking Yodi Gang meetup at this local mall. Okay. <laughs> And yeah, again, 50 plus kids show up. You feel me? We're at a mall though. And we're like, fuck them, let's get faded. And I had strictly said on my story, this is not a smoke sesh. We're just gonna vibe and yeah. like, you feel me? It'll be a good, positive time. They pull up, these kids, they're like, let's get faded, let's get faded. They're going into the hot topic, sparking up joints. <laughs> oh. I'm like, yo, put oh. that shit away, bro. I told you guys this oh. wasn't a fucking smoke sesh. And the 16 year old kid, he's like, I'm sorry, fuck him. He puts his joint away. <laughs> He walks out the hot topic and the, the cop arrests him and there's like a fucking <laughs> mob of fucking kids surrounding this arrest going on, you feel me? And yo, me and my homie Dill Cheese, we'd have dipped to the car. We're like, hell no. We dipped to the car. Not today. that bitch, you feel me? Fuck no. I, one thing about me, I'm leaving when I get the sense it's time to leave, bro. We like were when out you know, there, oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. You we got that feeling. That sometimes you know. Yeah, yeah. Sometimes, sometimes you, know. you just know for sure. Out that bitch, bro. Fuck no. <laughs> And that kid, so I did a clean, a uh, Yodi gang cleanup in December 2022. Mm-hmm. The kid who got arrested, he came to the cleanup. He's like, "Yo, I, I apologize, bro. I know you said no smoking. I apologize, bro." Yeah, yeah. He came back. How long ago, or how long after that was the event, or how long? So that was like a month after. Oh, okay. You pulled up after. Yeah. So I did the Yodi gang cleanup because I was like, "Yo, I can't just like do smoke sessions with these motherfuckers." <laughs> I'm, I was yeah. like, "Yo, I'll make these kids pick up trash, bro." Yeah. <laughs> Make these kids pick up some motherfucking trash, bro. <laughs> and so they like, fuck, let's community. take a blinker. Fuck no, fill up a fucking trash bag, bro. Yeah, hell yeah, for the community. Yeah, yeah, facts. That's real shit. Facts, facts, facts. Hell yeah, man. Hell yeah. Damn, those go well, huh? You, you throwing a couple of those. Yeah, I just threw my second one last week. 
Word. In uh, Antioch? Was that your hometown? Yeah, Antioch. So I've probably done it like, probably like six times type shit, you feel mm-hmm. me? But I've done it two times with the Yodi gang. And I do it at the same spot every time because that's where I blew up making videos. Mm-hmm. So it's like the holy land of Yodi land to me, that's bro. That's the Yodi land? But it's like, I was, it. do- I was doing it before I blew up type shit just because like, that was like, I would go out into nature and shit, like, I don't know, and just think a lot and, like, manifest and shit, bro. For real, for real. I went out there and made videos and shit, too. Oh, Went really? out to nature and make videos. That, that location means a lot to me. So we, yeah, always go out, we always go out and clean it. Fuck yeah. Me and, my, still, yeah. me and my homie, Matthew E, bro, like, like, I'm not a fucking perfect person, bro. Like, real shit. Like, we used to fucking steal beers from the stove. <laughs> But like real shit, before I had clout, bro, me and Matthew, you would go out to that park, steal some beer, like, and then go clean that bitch up for real. Nice. Like good oh, karma yeah. after it. Make you feel, yeah, that's what I would do. Yeah. That's yeah, we, it was a karma thing. We do that shit for it's paid karma's for real. It. Karma's Car- real, bro. Karma's yeah. real for sure. The karma's hella real. It'll hit you eventually, you know. Maybe not today or tomorrow. If you're a bad person, I feel like eventually you'll get your little comeuppance. Dealing's not cool. Dealing's bad. Dealing's bad. That's why I'm glad like this <coughs> shit works out. We don't have to do no lame shit. Word, word, yeah, one hundred percent. Like, yeah, we're all very blessed to be able to just fucking one hundred percent. Yeah, because it's not it doesn't feel good to steal. Like, it really doesn't feel good. Yeah. You ever meet someone that's like obsessed with stealing? A little kleptomaniac. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's really just like take some shit no matter what. Such a crazy I feel word. like it's mainly like girls that I know. They're like, really? we'll like go to a restaurant. Like, I want this cup, bro. Oh, yes, the cup. they're oh like my the cup God. in their fucking bag. And I'm like, I went to high school like, with some stealing? girls who would go to restaurants uh, and take like it. silverware and shit. Yeah, literally just take random shit. But this is a cute salt shaker and just like take it. Just like that's wild. Yo, that's kind of fire though. Gotta respect it. Walk out the store with the fucking soda glass, a nice one. Like yeah, with some ice. In that hole, and you just walk out like peace, guys. I'm gonna yeah. root beer cup with me. <laughs> What's the best soda? Ooh. Ginger ale. Really? Oh, that's the best soda, soda? Yeah, 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 bro. That's yeah. what I'm talking about. That's the best one. That's what I'm talking yeah, about. That's a question he was like, he was, ta- he was like, oh, that's an old man drink. Shut your ass up, man. <laughs> Shut your bitch ass up. Can- bro, Tell Canada him. Dry. Tell us that. Like Canada no, Dry. That, come Damn, on, let them know. All right, what's your number two soda? Dr. Pepper. Yeah! yeah. 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 Goblin's yeah. 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 That's, that's, that, that's your number one. one. Yeah. Yeah. That's my number that's one. Good. What's your number there. one? Hey, can I Maybe root beer. Might be I'll fuck with root beer. Root beer is good. Yeah, yeah root beer is right. good. Root beer is good. Go. There we go. It's like a little vanilla action, you know? Root beer floats are fire. Oh my God. Oh, some bro. ice cream in that shit. I haven't mm-hmm. had a root beer. You get a proper ice cream? Might have to do that tonight. Yeah, bro. Dude. Might have to do that tonight. Bro, the little, like, um, Ice cream, like fucking shards of ice that form when the ice cream and the root beer collide, and yeah. they oh. the foam shards, <laughs> the foam <laughs> shards. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah. my god, this is unbelievable. Damn, I can't even believe. Yeah, it. what's your favorite city? What's tonight? your favorite city you've been to? I know you've been to a couple cities with the tour and shit, content. <laughs> oh fuck, bro, that's a hard one. Like in life or just since I've been doing YouTube? Just in life too. Bro, Sweden. I love Sweden, bro. I haven't been since 2019, but Whoa. I got family members in Sweden. My dad's sister moved there in like 2008. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. And I've been there he- like three times. Yeah. 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 So I love Sweden, bro. That's definitely Sweden's somewhere I Sweden, visit. like the capital? They're in Uppsala. That's, that's like an uh, hour and a half from Stockholm. Oh, word. Yeah, that's definitely somewhere I'd want to visit. I want to it's beautiful, Uppsala. man. Yeah. You can't get faded out there. You have to be super discreet. You're oh, get fu- you'll get shit. fucked. <laughs> what happens if you get caught getting faded out there? You might go to jail, bro, like ASAP Rocky. Oh, <laughs> shit. Nothing. Yeah, Sweden's fucked. They don't care out there, huh? Damn. Damn. Well, I don't want to go anymore. Yeah, just bring a wax pan. Oh, true. Mm. True. Think I could bring like a Buffco and some hash? No. <laughs> That's risky. That's sketchy. That's scary. Yeah. That's yeah. Scary. That's it's literally K9 units when you touch it. down. K9 oh. units. <laughs> not worth. Not worth. <laughs> no. Nah, drink some beer fucking while you're there, dude. You'll be all right. No, dude. Just smoke some cigarettes, bro. Yeah. <laughs> be a man. Yeah. So yeah. Being a bitch. yeah. I'll just <laughs> smoke some fucking cigarettes. Yeah, I'm smoking a cigar beer. every single day when I'm in Sweden. Bro. Actually, yeah, and there's no weed, bro. What the hell? Uh, What's the Swedish something. cigarette game like? Is it good? I don't. I never smoked cigarettes. I was smoking cigars, oh. Oh. and like I buy a vape in Sweden. Okay, they got good vapes. It was so shit, bro. Oh. It was really shit, but oh. I was really missing weed. I was watching fucking Eric Khan, Mr. THC, dope as yo, like head, like on repeat in Sweden. Like I can't wait to go back home and smoke weed. <laughs> 
Because I was there for a month. Oh, shit. Yeah. That's a long time. Damn, that is a long ass time. She had a tea break. Yeah. yeah. And I was just watching weed, too. Like, damn, when I get home, I'm going to make a YouTube channel and do this. That's exactly what I did. A month a month of watching weed tube in like Europe, I go home, make my channel. I bought a zip of weed and made my first couple like Fuck videos on yeah. Daniel Luck 925. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. What's 925 mean? Is that area code? That's my, that's the, um, yeah, the area code. Hey, East Bay. Yeah. Oh, East Bay. Antioch? Yeah, Antioch, Brantwood, oh, Concord, right. all the whole East, East Bay. 925, baby. Fuck yeah. 925. Nah, that's. Can I take a dab out of that? We got a, we got a dab anywhere? You want to take a dab out of this one? Is there a bowl p What? Uh, this? Yeah, can I use that? Yeah, of course. Thanks, brother. Is there a bowl poker anywhere on the table? What the heck is that? Uh, something to feed a little bowl left. You want to break this shit in half? Oh, yes. I. Oh, oh wait. Josefo oh, just saved my life. W, W. Thank you, Josefo. W, W. Everyone in the comments, thank Josefo. Yeah. Uh oh, Goblin, what the hell? Oh, my bad. Come on, Gob. My bad, bro. Yo, remember when uh, I prank called you? Yes, yes, actually. <laughs> that prank called me too. <laughs> yeah, I'm fucking Mr. THC prank called you. <laughs> right? Or am I getting fucked up? I think it was you. Really? It was y'all. What, what did he say to you, Eric? Because I remember what he said to me. Oh, Pizza Brian called you and I called Eric. <laughs> no, I think Mr. THC called you, bro. No, no I, I think it was. Know, I think it was pizza. I Brian called you. I called you. Yeah, Someone you called me because they were like, you. Pizza "Hey, it's me. the prostitute you ordered to match your door." Yeah, they called and me. I was they like, called what? me. And they're like, the "Dude, I wasn't home. I was in Texas, and I thought the prank was that they actually ordered the prostitute to my door. I thought that was the prank, and I was like, "What?" I was like, "Hey, dude." I was like, "What do I tell this girl?" <laughs> Just wait. Like, come we tell me. Like, come back. Do, when I come, home. come inside and tell her come back later. <laughs> call me home ASAP. <laughs> <laughs> He's just him like impersonating, impersonating the prostitute. Uh, I'm oh, smacked, bro. Geeked. Fuck, feeling, another dab, I'm I guess. Great. Why not? Uh, Why not? Yeah, that Astro Club uh, fucking wax. That archive. Can I smoke it? Ooh, shit. Thanks, man. I'll take a little something. Wow. Let's get Simpsons very high. Right bro, I made sure to swoop everything on that table last night. You were swooping? Yeah. I swooped the pillow. Shout out to Astro Club. You yes. did? Yeah, I got the uh, Leafy Coach pillow. Bro. Oh my god, Wiz's team wants all that shit back. I you're swear lying, to you. Shit is wax, shit. <laughs> so they want it all back. <laughs> yeah, bro. That was a cool little grab bong, I will say. Was it the student glass or what? Yeah, yeah, yeah it was a Khalifa Kush one. Bro, it was oh, a yeah. pimped out little, th pimped out little rib. Those things hit pretty good. They do be yeah, smacking. I got high off of it. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> how much do they cost? <laughs> Six hundred dollars, wow. six seven hundred bucks. Yeah. No way. Yeah, yeah. Really? I think six hundred dollars. They want that shit back. You have one though, right? Yeah. I don't have one, bro. Damn. Be like, hey, I don't have one. Can I? Just take they it. They told home? me they were gonna send me one, but I never got one, bro. But I need that's one. That's the one for you. There Just tell them that. Be like, dude. That's that's what I was assuming. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfuckers. There it is. Vibration yeah. What the fuck? All right, bring it back. There'll be another one. One day. I'm not even tripping, bro. Like, Wiz's team, they were all cool as fuck. Wiz is cool as fuck, bro. Now, the stream was, stream, was flawless. It was, yeah. it was flawless. Yeah, it was I, I, I just enjoyed watching. I watched it as a, just a fucking fan and a viewer. And it was cool to see everybody there. It went super smooth. Wiz, had, he looked like he had a fantastic time. He was enjoying yep. himself. Yeah, bro. It was crazy to see like, how he of fucked the with the movement, bro. The two chicks at the end. Classic. Bro, bro. Okay, yeah. hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I don't want to say nothing, but you brought it up. So, bro, you made the funniest fucking face, dog, Eric, at the end, bro, when fucking homegirl was like trying to take a picture with you. Oh, and then at the end, she like did some weird extra shit. Yeah, like, yeah. Uh, like, and then Eric, Eric, was like, Eric was like, Eric was like, Eric was like, what the fuck is going on right now? Like, he tried to pull away. That so shit was someone, priceless, bro, dog. Bro, someone made a clip. Like, someone clipped it on kick, and the clip is titled, like, Woman Harasses Eric. <laughs> <laughs> and, bro, we're, we're dying laughing. Dude, yeah, yeah, bro, I was, I was, was rolling. Yeah. I was dying. I was laughing so fucking hard, You bro. saw that shit live? Yeah. Bro, that shit was so I was so rolling, funny, bro. I was like, no fucking way that just happened, bro. That was a funny Wait, shit. We gotta find this clip. It was bro. fucking gotta, hilarious. Oh, my God. Fucking gold. I haven't seen this clip. Fucking no, yeah, yeah, I, I yeah, watched like some of the streams, It was strange. It was like she I don't know. The vibes were hecka weird. Yeah. Who yeah, were they? Like, like were they just some nowhere. some OnlyFans hoes or like who Groovy were they? Money sent those chicks up. They're the porn star chicks. Oh yeah. Groovy Money <laughs> sent them up. They're like, you Which should go porn up there stars? And be a funny their... joke. <laughs> 
Bruh. <laughs> That's fucking crazy. It was, it was, it was a great clip. Yeah, one of them is like, um, you know, Yardeen, the dispensary in Vegas okay. or yeah, like yeah, Nevada. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. One of them is um, like a show girl for him or like okay. smokes weed for like an influencer girl okay, for cool. or like kind of thing. But uh, we didn't know that. We only knew that after. They didn't, you just, you they, like, they didn't introduce themselves. Those weren't your friends or nothing? Nah, 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 nah. nah. Damn, that remember. makes it even fucking weirder. Yeah. That's Yo, because it was so funny. Because she was, was like hilarious. grabbing on you at the end and you yeah, were just, yeah, no, you were like, not having, having it. Like, it was fuck. You were just like, what the <laughs> fuck is yeah, happening? What? Nah, it was, shit was funny, bro. It was mad funny. <laughs> I was, no, laughing, I was and, laughing my ass me off. Me and Ari just looked at each other and just started dying. No, that's what made it even. Y'all, y'all started laughing too. I was like, oh, this is fucking great. <laughs> she was saying some crazy shit about like mental health and stuff. Oh, it was fucking uh, wild. Uh, <laughs> she bet. says she drains Simp's wallets. Yeah, that's like her, her thing. What? Her specialization. I mean, like, and she says it's good for them. <laughs> it's like crazy. a humiliation thing. It's like that's crazy. they like to see someone else. But they, they consensually. Um, Drain their wallet to them. Yeah. How much money do you think she's draining? Right. Here, I don't though? know. Like, is she capping? Like, <coughs> she just can't have, like, some dude who sends her like 20 bucks and he's like, a little spree. Show me your asshole. Oh, probably, bro. Yeah. Humiliates these sad people. Yeah. You guys I mean, don't do that. <laughs> yeah. Don't do that shit. It's not good for your mental health. Listen, yeah, you don't be sending you, money. Don't you be sending shit. You can go. It's 2024, bro. You could go on for free. Well, they can show their on a different sides. Yeah, they shouldn't show their boho. <laughs> well, yeah, they shouldn't. I agree with you, bad, honestly. You should keep that to yourself. Maybe you can pop a titty out. That's okay. They, yeah, the girls you can, can pop some titties girls out. Girls can do what they want, but like, if you're a guy, it's your responsibility not to do like. Well, I wasn't. Yeah, yeah, I was talking more about the girls doing that because you know like, they be. Sure I mean, I was yeah, through Twitter Aaron, Aaron, and you like, fucking be responsible. Don't show your ass. Yeah, don't show your that's asshole on that's that's social fair, media. I swear to God, Eric, that's true. No leaks. No, I hate seeing that shit on Twitter, bro. Like, we don't even look it up and we see the bro. Literally, you just scroll through Twitter and there's just. Unsolicited, the unsolicited ads, dude. It's oh, the worst. I'm, glad, replies, I'm glad the community notes hits them, though. I, I fucking love when the community notes hit. This is, this an, is, an, yeah. this is an unsolicited yeah. ad of an Thank OnlyFans God, girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I mute those, those accounts whenever I see them. I have a lot of those God, daily meme accounts. Those accounts even, I did not look up Adam22's wife get railed by that dude, but oh still, my I still God. saw it. I saw it. I've seen so many like paused moments of it from scrolling through Twitter. Dude, that's what I'm saying. I've seen the whole video, dude. That's You're just nuts. seeing her getting pounded. Dude. I, can, I didn't look it up. <laughs> yeah, right? There's no way you can use your phone anymore as Adam22. You, you can't bro, scroll through Twitter. Bro, no when I'm at the bro. airport, I don't go on Twitter because like, I just can't scroll. Some stranger <laughs> next to like, <laughs> whoa, can't whoa. scroll it, bro. <laughs> yeah, you better look scary. around and shit. Yes, you gotta be like, <laughs> am I good, bro? There's no one else around me. And then you can scroll Twitter. Nah, There's like 100%. blown up babies on that shit, bro. bro. Like, Dead, yeah, gore videos. Worse. You're trying to see like a funny reply and you're like, bro, you There's know, no funny replies anymore. And then the bots just like come in the replies of viral tweets and just like rephrase it or like put some irrelevant ass shit in there. I'm all for free speech, but there's some things that can't be like out there and like promoted to you if you're not looking it up. Yeah, bro. promote it yeah. for sure. Promote it for sure. Like just because it gets traction doesn't mean I want to see it. Like all you see is drank and people smoking fan and blow, <laughs> blown up. No, I, I swear have seen a lot more drugs. I've so seen a much lot more lean drugs. on my fucking yeah, Twitter bro. timeline. Yeah. It's ridiculous. And they get hella likes and shit. Yeah. People reply to it and they're like, where you get this, bro? Like this hella is cool. likes, like, dude. Like drugs. Like, like hot damn, bro. You know, yeah. like people gas it up. There's a lot of weird parts of Twitter. Bro, I've been on yeah. some weird deep dives of Twitter. Eating like, disorder Twitter. Oh, it's called like ED Twitter. Yeah. ED Twitter. That's the worst one. I've got to Twitter. That's the worst one. Twitter. 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 Yeah. <laughs> that way. That's uh, crazy, hopefully they don't clip this. Uh oh. Nah, it's, they're they're friendly. Nah, they're, no, they're really not friendly people. Like that's why we don't like it. You know. They feel I mean, like they're really hostile people. Like Twitter's just a really hostile place. I it is. Like, There's a lot of like reason. people are too opinionated. No one really respects yeah, others' opinions. On like if, no one knows how to just be like, okay, you know. Like, Twitter's like a hater ass. I disagree. You know, no one can just be like, I disagree. You know. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, everyone has to like convince you of their opinion. It's on, like the same three Twitter. accounts that always post the same shit. Yeah. Yeah. Or, like, Productive conversations ass. are good, but it's like a lot of people don't want to do that. They just want to argue and like. You yeah. feel me? Like prove you wrong or like don't yeah. you type shit. They're trying to go for clicks. You know, everyone just tries to go for clicks on your ass. Like, bro. Trying yeah. to ratio you? Man. You ever been ratioed? Hell yeah. Fuck <laughs> yeah, bro. Have you? Probably, for sure. Tweeting some shit bro, out there I've been, in the void. I've been ratioed. Yeah, hell yeah, it happens. It does happen, man. It does happen. Those Every now and then you do get ratioed, yeah. Can't make everyone happy. I'll be deleting the tweet. Oh. <laughs> 
If I get rid of Shields, I'm deleting it. You don't be standing on I business. got my controversial Author. shit up. Author has yeah, deleted yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you had a lot of controversy up in the past like week. It was really the blinker thing that really took it all off. Huh? People were like, ah, now this is the line cross. Like you're turning on us. <laughs> yes. Bro, people said, you're yeah, supposed to be one that. of the good ones. They said, I, you turned on me. <laughs> you're like, damn, not my goat. <laughs> damn, not oh. my goat. Fuck, taking shots at It's him. like, bro, is that really that sad? Like, if you really watched any YouTube video I dropped in the past six months, you see, like, I'm not taking blinkers like that. Yeah. So I was like, how, what the hell are y'all talking about? How do you deal with comments like that? Do those, do those like, do those bother you? Or how do you take those? Like, do you... Uh, nah, bro, you just have to have good balance, bro. Like, with real life. This just not real life, honestly. Yeah, for sure. Sometimes you could get lost in the sauce, but you just have to have good support system, yeah. like... Friends and family. Yeah, for Some sure. Some people to be like, bro, you're tripping. You yeah. yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You need, you need like big brothers. You need fucking, yeah, you just need good unk. people in your you life. Unk in your life. Yeah, you good women too. True. True. Good women. True, true, true. Yeah. Yeah, you just got to keep a balanced life for real. Outside of the whole internet YouTube shit. Yeah, because I feel like we grew up in a time where like the internet and real life are like two very different things. Mm -hmm. I almost had like an internet life and then like a real life yes. life, you know? But now it's like... Now everyone's, everyone's just same. like, so yeah. It's so yeah. weird, it's isn't like it? It's like social media is like your life. And it's like, nah, what? It's like, yeah. social media ain't real, bro. No you know? one knew about like my internet life. Because they could life. turn the internet off, bro. What, what then? <laughs> well, that would, that would be <laughs> fucked. Ow, what would you do if they just turned the internet off? Like, what do we do about that? We can't, we probably can't just get that bitch back up, huh? That's I mean, we, we built, we got to this point. <laughs> I can barely get home without We got good connections. <laughs> like, we, we built our shit. We got good connections. We'd be, we'd be kind of straight in a way, you feel me? True. We probably, like, in a way, like, we band together with the people we know and shit, you feel me? Start some tribes. Would it just be. <laughs> <laughs> Start some tribes. We're back to well, teamwork makes living. the fucking dream work. You guys know, like, True. True. you can't you can't be a one man army forever type shit. You feel me? Like, I was filming, editing my videos, making the TikToks, doing this, this, and that. You can't do it all by yourself. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. You need a team. You got a nice little team. You got like a manager now and everything. Yep. And That's I got dope. my homie Bryce. He does fulcrum clips. He uploads on my second channel. Dope. Nice. He dope. ran he ran up the racks on the second channel. Hell yeah. That's okay. right. Good Hell for him, yeah. bro. Good and I, I haven't posted a single video. He just clips my stream highlights and posts them on there. Dope. Bryce is the goat, bro. My manager's the goat too, bro. For real, for real. It's real shit, man. You're running it up on the platforms. Do you like short form content? Like, do you like making it? Or do you like long form content better? I like both, but I had to adjust to the game with the short form content. Right. Because we grow up from a time where we have attention spans still. You feel me? Yeah. Maybe we don't have attention spans like the older people. Like, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But these Gen Z kids, they can't handle a 10 minute video. Sure. Or what are the, what's younger than Gen Z? Zoomer? I don't know. It's Zoomer, right? I don't know. Are they officially called Zoomers? I don't um, know. I think Zoomer is Gen Z. But they can only handle like 15 second clip. So I had to adjust the, to the game in a, in a way. Yeah, yeah. Nah, it's fucked up. Well, not nah, like people our age, like even they can't handle fucking long form content. Too. Right. It's like, like, like everyone's, it's it's like like everyone's attention games. span went down. 100%. TikTok fucked not, the game up. Yeah, it's not just kids. There's like long form TikToks now, two, three minutes. Instagram I guess. too. People spent hours scrolling on that hole. Dude, just fucking mindlessly. The reels. It's kind of easy sometimes to just like you watch one or two and you're like oh, it's locked like in. Fifteen minutes. You gotta get out of it. And it'd be some bullshit like yeah, some, some yeah. dude throwing ping pong ball like trick shots and shit like <laughs> bruh. Most like the most normies normies nonsense. Yeah, yeah, or yeah. then you see some weird Asian kid on a plane screaming like faded and shit. <laughs> That was a crazy bit. What made you, was that in the middle of the flight? Like it's in the air? That was like when we first, like the seatbelt sign first got off. So I was like, <laughs> did you wait to the end? <laughs> yeah, man, I did at the beginning of the flight. Like, let's let everybody know what time it is. Did you just like walk back to your seat and the people next to you were like, nice. Or, did you, anyone say anything? No, uh, no, nah, but dude, I just sat back down and acted like nothing happened. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and everybody else did the same thing too, for sure. And they did. No one, no one looked at me or anything. They just minded their business. Everyone's an NPC. Like, man, oh, I swear. something's wrong with him. <laughs> it's like, it's have you ever, have you ever like, started okay, to like people like that? <laughs> <laughs> have you ever started to do your intro or something in person and people recognize it or hear it? Yeah, all the time, bro. <laughs> Especially my hometown, bro. It's like in my hometown, the 
They show a lot of love in my hometown, Fuck bro. Yeah. I'm grateful I can go outside and it's like... Not 100%. They show it's love. all love, yeah. Yeah, bro. I've never had anyone come up and be like, fuck you, I don't like what you said here. Fuck you, this, this, and that. Because that's just not yeah. real. Like, you hear that that's on Twitter the thing, all the you time. Gotta remember, like, bro, you remember, bro, the haters, like, the motherfuckers are... They'll never, like, come up to you and say that shit. Right. No one's they ever barely exist like, in fuck person, you. you know? Someone doesn't and like you, they're not going to come up to you. If they say that yeah. online, they might come up in person and be like, bro, I fuck with your channel, bro. Yeah, literally, literally. You never know. For sure. And I fuck with all the fucking people who fuck with the movement, bro. You feel yeah, me? Real yeah, shit. Yeah. I want to see everyone win at the end of the day. Like, of course. A hundred percent. Yeah. It's not like I, I just want to shit on the viewers and act like I'm better than y'all. Because I'm not, nah. bro. I'm just this weird kid. You feel me? But <laughs> I do know that, like, if you truly want it, you can go out and get it. Like, no matter who you are. hundred percent. hundred percent. No matter where you come from. Come on now. I say that with confidence too and conviction, like no matter who the fuck you are, bro. Right. Yep. Wow, 100% type shit. Speaking of crazy videos, we got a couple things to watch. What do you got for us, Jose? Ooh. Okay. K2. Oh. K2 Chronicles, number oh. four. Bro, that's you got to get us the other that's three. That's what Eric just smoked. <laughs> what the oh, fuck? Let's go. Is he in the jail? Take four. K2. Oh, he in the jail. K2 Chronicles. Yo, they're smoking in the jail, getting lit. Wow. Oh, oh. he's leaning. He's not in for sure. He's holding on. He's holding on. He's got this. He's got this, dude. He's clutching. He's probably Don't seeing fall. shit because he's on the K2. Don't fall. <laughs> Don't fall. K2? Nah, but I heard it's psychedelic. Fuck. Yeah, you probably do see things. He's probably hearing things. He probably turned into the floor. <laughs> dude is locked in. Holy fuck. He doesn't stop leaning. Wow. That's good. He K2. didn't fall down, man. Respect. In jail? I didn't know you could have hats in jail. That's pretty clean. <laughs> I didn't know you can have hats. <laughs> I didn't know that. Yeah, wait. Dude's worried yeah, about, that hats, hats, worry hat, about the hats, yeah, not the fucking K2. That inspired me to try it. <laughs> can we do a K2 stream? Whoa, man. That would be fine. We just say it's like real weed. This is real weed, guys. We're just smoking weed. Then we just oh, slump. shit. What is this guy doing? Wait, whoa. what the fuck? Just like that. Yeah. Yeah, boy. What the fuck is he doing? Oh, he's, he's gliding. Oh, he's going downhill? Oh, this is a bad idea, bro. What is he doing? He can steer it, though, yeah. Get in the car. Wait, what is he doing? I guess he's just steering the whip. Get in the car. Oh, shit. I drank the water. Oh. You know what? I feel like this was like the guy that crashed a plane on purpose. Bro, what? I, I feel like this, was, this guy just crashed his car on purpose right now. Holy sh! Insurance fraud. The seat fell out. Insurance fraud, man. Thanks for sticking around, guys. Like he Thanks sounds, for sticking yeah, around. Yeah, he sounds, it sounds like such a fucking YouTube video. And insurance claim. That was the dumbest shit I've ever done. You filmed it and posted it. He said the dumbest shit I've ever done. I mean, yeah, he shouldn't have posted it. Yeah, yeah he could have got the racks. He could have. Well, someone ran me off the road. He's in the middle of the woods. Yeah, exactly. Could have easily. There's no one to say he. A that deer didn't jumped happen. in my car. A deer. Yeah. <laughs> Where's well, the deer? Well, no, because then the deer, you could. Yeah. yeah. They could blind. blame it on you if you blame it on another driver. Then you're fucking locked in. You Yo, like, why oh, didn't he just sit in the car? What was going on? There? No, like I did it on purpose. He was making a YouTube video. That guy crashed his bip on purpose. Like a scary scary looking man, he hit me and drove away. (laughs) Yeah, yeah, he hit me off the road, hit and run. I was sad. Oh, it's a world. I was star on the side of the road. What sad. the fuck? Someone Until I called. Do you remember World Star used to be like the biggest? I thing? fucking love. It's still big. I loved it's, hearing it's World Star. World Star someone get KO'd. You world remember when like star. if a music video got posted on World Star Hip Hop, it was just like it was that shit. It was that bro. shit. Yeah, yeah. it, it was, had that intro. And it was like, had to be a banger. Yeah, World Star intro had to be a hit. Hang on. It's oh, I feel like this is gonna be bad. Yeah, skate videos are dangerous, bro. Oh, he about to break something. Oh wait, nice. That's true. Okay, oh. okay. Oh, he's taking a no bong way, rip. man. No way. Oh, no, is oh, it a dab? Girl. Yeah. Oh. oh. Oh, it's a bong rip. That was actually fire. That was fire. Nah, that's gas. There's no way. Jeez. That's that was impressive. that was actually That was amazing. actually... That was super sick. That was, that was amazing. Like Marty Dobaziola. What a beast. Respect. <laughs> that's Marty right there. Respect. Big ups, Marty. Big ups, Marty. Wow, what a vid. Holy shit. That's impressive, man. That was actually that was so clean. Good. Yeah, was, I'm glad we got a good video. Sometimes we see some oh fuck shit. Oh my oh, man! Damn, these guys already have a mess uh, going on. What the fuck are they doing here? Oh no! They're trying to. Yeah, they're just gonna make it worse. These guys are some yeah. fucking idiots. Fired. They sodas? Oh are these? no! Oh, All the fucking oh sodas. They knocked over. Oh, bro, it's like Red Bull. Or yeah, it looks like a Red Bull Red Bull factory for sure. 
Go, 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 go. <laughs> Why are them dumbasses putting them in fucking cases or some shit, man? Yeah, for real. Why are they, why are they like, loose ass fucking bottles? <laughs> yeah, they're not wrapped oh, or nothing. No. Like, yeah, it's dumb. Weed. Dumb. Well, maybe they're in the pro. Maybe that's the next step. Right dude, they're here. like they're fucking giant statues, dude. These yeah, are this is huge. crazy. Towers. These towers are massive. Red and blue. Wow. You definitely fired after that for sure, though. Yeah, he it's lost a, his job. Rad. He lost. There's no explaining that. Catastrophe. I'd be, bro, I'd be fucking. Hold on, it's started. I'd be so funny if I did that. <laughs> bro, who who has to clean that, though? Dude. Like, not, it's probably going to be a big yeah, machine, yeah. right? Just like Which a, employees oh. do they send in to be like, yo? Everyone just quits that day. <laughs> <laughs> it's only like two managers in there just mopping that shit up. And then they just Damn, quit. And it's an empty facility. <laughs> And then heck of bums move in. They're just drinking Red Bull. Yeah, they just keep dark off Red Bull and crack up. for like three years. <laughs> they got their wings. <laughs> and then they consume every bottle. <laughs> <laughs> they run out and they start going around and like robbing all the 7-Elevens to get more. They're like feeding for it. They're addicts. Bruh. Bruh, Red Bull gives <laughs> they probably wings, wouldn't right? be able to live without it. <laughs> yeah, never. I mean, bro. Would they ever have to? Like, how many cans do you think are in there, bro? That had to be, like... Oh 200,000, No, um, Bro, I think... No, I think you're right. I think it was probably something around, like, 200,000 cans. If it was 200,000 yeah, cans... Right. Holy fuck. Bro. Hey, you drink Red Nah, but I would want to explode, like, 200 lighters in there. Oh, Damn. You want to explode Damn. some lighters? Yeah, I like exploding when you throw them on the ground all hard. No, so have you seen my video where I exploded 50 lighters? Dude, you did it for like a celebration, right? Or did you just nah. pop that video? <laughs> that was for a celebration, dog. Exploded 50 went, lighters. I went behind the old movie theater and basically got a box of 50 lighters, put a shirt over them, lit the shirt on fire, and watched them explode. And they're just shooting out. Pow, pow, That's pow, pow, <laughs> for like 15, 20 minutes. Damn, minutes? Yeah, and every Holy time we shit. thought it was done, we go up to it and one fucking light will go pow and we go. Oh, oh it's like fireworks? Yeah, bro, it's so dangerous. Do not do that at home. <laughs> do not, yeah, bro. Do that's not do that at home. Bro. Hell no. No one got hurt and you can get burned or nothing? Nah, we, we Let's go. Yeah. Nah, but we were good. That's a W. That's a W. That's dangerous stuff. Yeah, man. that is. But I was in the video, I'm walking up to the fucking lighters and a fucking lighter just flies right over my head. <laughs> Bro, what the fuck? You got a favorite video you've ever made? Um, yeah, some of the older ones that have like no views, like the video Weird. where I have a smoke sesh at PF Chang's with my homies who are just rolling up Fire. joints and shit. Yeah. That Fire. video has like the no view no views, bro. Cause that's when I had like a hundred subs. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. The older video? Yeah, I really like those videos, bro. Fuck yeah. Watching those videos is kind of crazy. It's trippy, bro. I can't even believe life sometimes, bro. <laughs> It was just like such a short time ago, but it feels like a long time ago, you know? Yeah. It was only two years ago, bro. Dang. This shit's crazy. It is a short time ago. Two years, it's a very man. Short time. Two years ago, crazy. I was working full time. Bro. What you got? Uh, you got any advice for the people watching, listening right now that are in your spot? Yeah, or yeah. That, were, that were in your spot two years ago, grinding? The only moment you fail is when you give up. And if you truly want it, then you're going to go out and get it for real. Nice. For real. Yeah. Not and the, the only moment you have to go out and get it is the present moment. And so if you sit around waiting for the right time or thinking, I'm lame, I'm dumb, or you're thinking about the past or worrying about the future, it's like a distraction, bro. For sure. Instead of actually doing what you could be doing today, right now, here today. Are you feel me? 100%. A lot of shit's a distraction, huh? Yeah. There's a lot of distractions out in the... Uh, Even my videos are distractions. Mmm, true, true, in true. We're I'm... distracting the people from their missions. Oh, shit. Yeah. Get on your grind, motherfucker. Feel any self guilt about distracting people, dude? And I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Some people grind and listen to us, though, which is cool. They're at work. Yeah, for sure. I mean, I've listened, I watch your guys' podcast. Yeah. Hell yeah. yeah. That's real shit. Did you ever think about starting a podcast? Uh, it was an idea at one point, but I feel like I like fe being featured on podcasts rather than um, hosting it. Yeah. 100%. I feel that. No, nah, no, 100%. It's, it's dedication for sure. And yeah. you can't underplay yeah. like the hard work you guys put into it, bro. Yeah, like real sure. shit. You guys sure, put hard sure. work in. Hell yeah! I man. don't know if that's something I can commit to right now, but maybe one day I'll end up starting my own. Yeah, yeah I think you'd be good at it. Yeah, that should be good. Definitely be good. That'll be dope. That should be dope. Let us know. We can do it. Uh, you know, a little pine park action. It's hard work yeah. though. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hundred percent. It's a big setup for real, for real. Yeah, oh, you guys, crazy stuff. 
I got anything to say to the people? Where can the people find you, Fulcrum? Five Fulcrum on Goddammit Instagram, Damien Look925 on YouTube, kick.com yep. slash Fulcrum, Prod Fulcrum on Twitter. Yeah, yeah. Goddamn. What's your favorite platform right now that you're posting on? Twitter. Twitter's jokes. <laughs> Twitter's yeah. jokes. Twitter's bro. so chill. <laughs> <laughs> You get monetized off it too, fuck, bro. I made they paid me out twenty bucks for a month. Yeah, yeah. let's go, yeah. Bro, yeah, bro. I fucking I made um my first month they paid me and remember how like when they first monetized people they paid you for like fucking nine months worth of time. Really? So it was like no yeah, way. when they first That's monetized so people. They paid you for like nine months, like worth of time in one big payment, like because they Whoa. they had been secretly like tracking your ad revenue for the past nine months. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. I got like ninety dollars. Hey, so ten dollars a month. Yeah, I couldn't Let's believe go. it. I was like, hey. ninety bucks is chill as fuck. Yep. Thanks, Elon. Yeah, big ups. Mm-hmm. You know, twenty dollars is pretty. You know, nowadays it used to be a lot. Hey, for a month. <laughs> for a month, yeah, for that's pretty tough. That's less than a dollar a day. That's, that's pretty, pretty tough. Like millions yeah. of impressions is bullshit. Bro. That is pretty bullshit. You should be getting some. Yeah, that's crazy. Do you think video views get more? I know what's his name just posted his shit on there. Mr. Beast just posted a we'll video. See, we'll see what like, he oh, says. Yeah, it's got like a hundred something million so he, views. I mean, obviously he's, he's gonna like run up some racks. Grand. You think? Probably five grand. I think he made more, but I think he's gonna make some racks for sure. I, th- I, I think they might have inflated grand. it for him. You think? Nah, because if he inflated, no, he Elon tweeted, huge. Like Elon retweeted it. Yeah, so like crazy like, they made a big deal about it. Yeah, no, but if they if he like inflates the numbers, people will find out, and that'll be a terrible look for fucking Twitter. Yeah, like if he fucking Twitter's had some terrible looks recently. Bust, they don't give like, a fuck. They, yeah, I don't they know. Don't know. Elon gives a shit. <laughs> it's not gonna it's not gonna attract creators if he's faking the numbers. True, 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 true. That's not that's not gonna create any benefit for him. So I don't I doubt that. But yeah, yeah. there's he's definitely retweeting it for sure. You know, he's trying to get as many eyes on as possible. He'll yeah. probably make five to ten racks off of off of his fucking why not post it's not views it like like he, he might have, yeah, it's different. Like the ad that's why the way ad different. is 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 so different. Twitter's way different. They're probably giving you like like stands. Yeah. Like, yeah, the yeah, RPM yeah. is disgusting. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm yeah, sure yeah, it's yeah. disgusting. Yeah, yeah, not good. But hey, it's better than none, right? Fuck it. <laughs> Damn near. Yeah, I mean, it used I to guess be so. a thing. Right? Yeah. It used to be zero. It used to be not be a thing at all. That's Honestly, though, before we've been Twitter, using Twitter for free for years. Yeah. Before Twitter was monetized, though, I think the quality of content was a lot higher. Yeah. And yeah, with yeah, the yeah. pennies they're giving out for monetization, yeah. I'd rather not have it. It's just all clickbait now for fucking yeah, it's it's monetization revenue. It's, it's all I'd rather not farming. even have the money. People Honestly. doing like controversial takes for like, you know, like impression farming and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. 100%. Like stupid shit. Yeah. Stupid replies. I hate the replies. You know what I do? Like the replies used to be cool. is allowed. Weed is allowed on that Twitter. That is cool. Yeah, yeah we can't shit on it too heavy. Fire, shout out to I'll take Twitter. Twitter. I fuck with Twitter. It's my favorite platform. I'll yeah, take I fuck it. with Twitter. I fuck with Twitter. It's just because you can just like tweet shit and turn it off. Like Bro, it doesn't really affect anything else, I feel it's like. It's really you uncensored. Know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can yeah. say whatever on that hoe. You can't say, you can't do that on every platform. You can't right? do it on any other right. platform. Shit. Yeah, it's facts. Like, like dead ass. Like, yeah, well, Twitter's open. really uh, no other platform, huh? It's just Twitter. That's crazy. You can just post. You say some, you say some wild rips. rips. Yeah, you can literally you post size titties and bone rips yeah, on fucking bro. Facebook. You gone, gone, bro. You're you gone. post yeah, anything on Twitter, dude. Who, it's there's crazy. some people that's banned though. Like who's banned? They, um, they, they've honestly brought most people back on I Twitter. I mean, if you say like yeah. things that are you know racist or like sexist hateful, or like, like yeah, violent hateful shit. things, yeah, then you'll yeah. get banned. Inside but like, like threats, yeah, threats, yeah. Threats. You can post very like eighteen plus like super adult you stuff. Can have porn on Twitter, and as long as it's not like full, on Twitter, full porn, porn fun. Bro. full penetration. It used to be yeah, censored. censored. It used to be censored where you can click like view. You know what I mean? Nope, but now, now it's just like it's now you might just yeah yeah. Now sometimes you scroll through and you see it. Yeah, it just might be aggressive on your feed. Just whole dick, and you're like, whoa, whoa, whoa. You got dick on your timeline? What? Yeah. I don't got what? Dick on Wait, whoa. <laughs> bro, I see the most nastiest shit on fucking Twitter. Holy shit. <laughs> what, what, are what are you seeing? What are you seeing? So, someone replies to my tweet. I love you, Fulcrum. I click on their page. It's like, it's like someone dressed like a girl with a wiener, man. It's like, bro. <laughs> I'm jacking up, bro. Like, bro, come on. Like the first people's thing you see, people's yeah, pin yeah, tweets be aggressive. Yeah, the yeah, 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 bro. I've clicked yeah, on some yeah, profiles yeah, and I'm like, yeah, damn, your, your pin tweet is literally you getting fucked right here. This is crazy. That's, a, that's crazy. That's actually crazy, bro. bro. I just feel like there the, should be some sort of like, like nah, that can't nah, be the first impression of you like seeing everything. Like this is a just let it be free. Just let it be free. Because what if you're in public and like someone? Because honestly, when people 
people tweet things every sometimes you click on their profile twitter yeah, might be an like, oh, yeah, 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 exactly you know and like i don't know all the time when i click on someone's profile that i'm about to see boom. like a vagina or a cock and ball that's what i'm saying when there's dick on the feed you know? i'm saying there might you might oh, click there and just boom oh. dick and pussy yeah, boom, yeah. Right yeah. yeah you're, you're like, like whoa Oh, yeah, you're you're stroking that? aggressive. Uh, yeah. Bro, what the fuck, bro? <laughs> if you stuck so around to the end of this podcast, you got, you got a fucking Shit. great conversation. We need here. to do better. <laughs> yeah. That's, bro, it's our fault we're humans, bro. Like, we see this shit and it's our fault, too. We bro. just let it happen. <sighs> There's sometimes replies that like looking good. Oh, there's like, bookmarks. Bro, like, bro. Stop, <laughs> stro- yeah, stop stroking bookmarks. on the timeline, everybody. Please. And stop okay, hey, playing please. with your g- vagina on the timeline as well. Stop everything. Episode 79 is aggressive. Yeah, bro, I have a whole day planned. You see that shit? It's like, bro, what the heck? <laughs> it just throws it all off. And you're just making videos. You're like, what the heck? Yeah. <laughs> it just ruins, it just ruins your day. <laughs> whole vibes tone the fuck off. You just go to bed like, and you can't even sleep. You're like Anakin. And so <laughs> you close your eyes, you see it again. <laughs> yeah. Fuck. You're at nighttime no. just ruminating awake. <laughs> Thinking about this stroke, bro. Unbelievable. Like, Don't stop stroking, no. And then you get up from bed and look out the window. And you're like this. <laughs> And you, you like see it coming. Yeah. Like you almost like you think it's coming for you. Yeah. That I feel unbelievable, that. man. Hey, stay off Twitter, guys. But if you're going to be on stay Twitter, make sure to follow well, Fulcrum. Make sure <laughs> yeah. to follow Pine Park. Stay on Twitter, actually, to follow yeah. us. Hell yeah. Yeah, exactly. Follow and the report people. anything you see like that. Mm-hmm. Of course. Hit the reports, yep. man. Hit the reports. They got to work or something. Uh, shout out to Fulcrum for being here, man. Dude, thank <laughs> you so yeah. much for pulling up, bro. Long Long to waited. Waited. Out, bro. What a fucking luck, banger bro. today. Hell Needs yeah. What a banger. Appreciate you, man. Good meeting you, too, bro. Hell yeah. What a hit. Let's go. Hopefully, we can have you back real soon, man. And uh, we'll see y'all real motherfucking soon, baby. For next episode, make sure y'all drop a little W in the motherfucking stream. In the chat. I said stream. I said in the chat, too. The in the comments. Yeah. What is this comments? Friday. Premier's Friday. Or shit. Next Friday. Six days from now. Yeah. Okay. Uh, here we go. Yep, 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 yep. <clears throat> Give you a fantastic time, man. I'm, thank you for being here, bro. Hell yeah. Thank, thank you for having me. Coming. It was we'll see legendary. you guys next week. Thank Fuck you all for watching. Love, y'all. Peace. Deuces. Cool. How long do we go for?